But oh. the devil rigamortis. We are here now in the hells. We're right here, here in hell, next to the mirror of Mephistopheles. And this is where things will get very interesting. Now know exactly where did you go, Nigeria? You, I got to go. I don't know. I just started running through all the accents. I was feeling it. I, I was going to say that accent really like <laughs> traveled. <laughs> Fucking hell. I'm going to say that thing in Nigeria. I'm expecting it to sound decent. You did way. well, oh. my friend. Your <laughs> accent is very good. <laughs> Bits, shall you? Anyways, ladies, let's get fucking moving, shall we? Rudging. That yep, sounds like a good idea. Through the hell. As uh, Mr. No Soul leads the way, because he's the only one that knows what it is. Fuck's sake, Corey, it says that I'll walk across really your bed should. and put you in a puff. Yeah, I'm not in breath, that's just how I fucking am. Right. He's what? He's what? <laughs> Took more than four steps. That's his workout for the day. Done. Mad. You take your little walk Corey. through the hells. The wind howling, the blood pouring. You're watching as the huge plumes of dust, as the massive spiked towers seem to fly over in the distance. I don't have any images of the flying fortresses. Um, but you know, just just look up the Baldur's Gate three intro and you can see them beautifully. Anything's yeah. a deal with if you try hard enough. You ain't big enough, honey. But as you start walking, yeah. you pass by the little mountain once more. It's hot. It's hellish. It does take you quite some time passing down through here over a mountain. You see a building. You see it, not building. Pardon me. You see a mountain shaped like a clawed hand with a fortress that seems to be built round it. It's taking you to walk on some more. You see a, a forest of iron rock trees with the um, abyssal chickens once more. Oh, chicken. The fuck was that? This is <clears throat> keep heading on down and round. Y'all can, if necessarily need be, take a uh -huh. long rest. I think everybody failed their wisdom saving throw at this point. Correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, I have not, yeah. Then it looks like you're making a wisdom save. It looks like you're making a constitution saving throw before you make a wisdom saving throw. Beautiful. I don't think I failed any, did I? You're good. I don't have to take oh, any, Oh no, you, so failed, you failed the wisdom save. You were the first one to fail it. If you're talking, give me a second, I can't hear you. Now or some shit, oh. because we've been corrupted that, by that the that is save? No, you are... you already turned. Alright, cool. Yeah. So then we were, when we're what, long, re long resting? Long rest, and then you need to make another con save. Wait, wait are we all long resting, or...? Yeah, it takes quite a while to get here, so if you need to take a long rest, you can take a long rest. If you haven't expended anything, then don't worry. If you need... You're a sorcerer? No? Yes, you're I a sorcerer. I have exhausted, so I'd like to take that long rest. Yeah, I've not done anything yet, so I've still got all my spell slots. Oh. Yeah, because of uh, being a sorcerer, you don't prepare, you just have them all. But... And then what, another con save? Yeah. Oh! And a wisdom save as well. Just me or is it uh, just yeah. grey squares? Hi, where, where, where did I go? It's, it's just black. You have just seen grey squares? That, Nothing here? Yeah, just grey squares for me. I'm, all I'm seeing is, is Cody's worst thing here. Let me... Oh, fuck off. Try that. Uh, so you come this weirdly boy. shaped building. On the outside, <laughs> you can see numerous little windows <laughs> draping down the building. You can see lots and lots of chains. Yes, steps okay. and a metal door. This place almost seems familiar. <laughs> I like it. But are you? I also mm. can't move. Nope, the wrong. Pum pum pa. Try again now. Can anybody else move? Mm. No. Nope. What the? Be a no for me. Move it. Is that Movement is set to combat turn. Oh, thank you. I did not know it was set to combat. Let me fix that. Now, there you go. So, 
Really battery, good. battery and siren. You know these things. You have uh, been in the hills. Take us, I was taking me off the map though. I all the map we were on. It's put me back on the big map. Let me get this. Just now pull the scene. God, it's now Sweet. moved Ricky despite the fact we already moved back. Fuck's sake. Yeah. It's pulled you to the other map. It sure but, did. There we go. Oh, there we go. Stop. So, uh, battery, siren. Yous having been in the hells before, yous are aware that this is a Styx watchtower. And in mm -hmm. the Styx watchtowers, there can usually be found, among other things, a chain demon. A chain devil. A what? A chain devil. Yes. I, I chained mm -hmm. or chain. 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 Okay. You know that they have the ability to animate any chain around them and use them as needed. Mm -hmm. Cody's been a nosy bastard and running up to see what happened last session. No, I'm trying to find the name of that demon that we spoke to last time. Uh, didn't give a name, don't worry. Yes, did. I give it. The spoke to me in my head. Though. I'm just gonna roll a stealth check to be sneaky. The one in your head. I forget, but don't That's worry. That's not very sneaky. Okay. No, it wasn't Ronnie Radke's voices in my head, though. No, I forget, I forget the name. Don't worry, though. You're fine. If it were important, I'd have wrote it down. Wrote it down. <laughs> it was Rigor Mortis or some shit. No, it wasn't Rigor Mortis. That was the one I saw my soul to. Yeah, that, that was, yeah, but that's what he was calling himself. No, there was the one prior to yeah. that. Yeah. There was a like car. Yeah, there was two of them. <clears throat> yeah. Sorry, you had the name of that one. So it was easy to remember. Yeah, she's mm. walking around the area, taking a little look about. <clears throat> Got it. Can I perception at the door to see what I see? Oh my. I can tell you now I see seven to eight approximately uh You've been doing you've seen these ones before. Wow. These are bearded devils. Yeah. Mm. These things. There's, there's there's roughly seven or eight of them. Yeah, there's um Yeah, I've seen at least seven. There's, there's also is a lot of power that they have beards. What's that? I said, is there superpower that they have beards? Because the chain double. Probably that they can change. Probably that they can control that beard at will. It's that one scene from Dexter, uh, in Dexter's laboratory, where the guy just like wells a beard on his face. Her, <laughs> 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 like, like that one. Uh, it's like that one character from the boys that's just got a super long PP that he can just move however he wants. <laughs> oh, I mean, I love sausage. I, it, the one that's just, the one that's just like got the fucking absolute fucking yeah, love sausage. That's yeah. his name. Yeah. Is it actually <laughs> the fucking boys? Is yes, his name is, is love sausage. <laughs> I love how like at the end of like what are the like the things? Uh, 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 what? what? It's still too early. <laughs> it's still too early. No, no everyone was, has seen was, the final I was, season. I was referring to the fucking third Second season, season, whatever it is. Second season. Second season, where he's like, he just like fucking slams his pee pee into the door and it just like fucking takes it off the wall or something. Oh, I thought you were talking about the, like, the end scene where like, no, no man, she's on top of a building wanking. Anyway. That's not love sausage. Bring it in. You are walking around. Uh, <clears throat> Battery, you're seeing what you're seeing. You're also seeing that you are very close to the edge of the river Styx. You know for certain, um... Ew. Don't swim in it. Don't touch it. By any chance, Matthew, um, is it I'm really hot? I'm going to try not to. It's kind of hot, it's little... but it's, it's, it's hot enough yeah. to keep blood flowing. As blood thickens it like, as it stands. Is it yeah, like I'm, I'm going to avoid that, you know? the, uh, the blood I'm river. Like, Thank you very much. You is, it, some... is it like hot enough that if you went in it, you'd get burned? No, it's like 30 degrees. Mm -hmm. no, it's it's like a hot tub then. 
So it's like a warm Celsius. cup of soup. 30 Celsius, yeah. It's don't drink it. Yeah, don't touch it. Body. Drink it. Body soup. Yeah. Uh, um, turtle. Okay, you can I mean... perception if you like. Yes. Come on, baby. These guys friendly. No, oh, you know for a fact they ain't. I mean, do you want to go in the front door, or like you want to take them from the back? How do we want to do this, ladies? You, you're hearing these creatures speak. As for what they're saying, you don't quite know. As we pan on over, however, as the camera passes through and goes through the eyes of Battery and said, you are very much watching as they are playing with a set of cards. Ooh, they're gambling. Hey, we're in hell. I'm about to make a name for myself. Fuck. Oh, I'm about to make a name for myself. <laughs> the last thing you want to hear coming from in there. <laughs> oh, I'm about to make a name for myself. Does oh, anyone here a vampire? You might be <laughs> fucked. <laughs> Well, I'm about to make a name for myself up in here. Oh, I I'm about to make a name for myself up in here. <laughs> I keep getting the uh, Cajun guy. So who's Cajun at guy. the front door? Honestly, they not right, they uh, not passed it more perfectly. Yeah, I think he is Cajun, like part it's Cajun not. at least. So not no, not even that. It's just it's just because it's Channing Tatum. It's just because he's it's Channing willing Tatum. to do any role. He is like the single greatest actor behind Ryan Reynolds. But yeah. Oh, not about that, but yeah. yeah. No, he is. Let's Ryan Reynolds. Focus! Take some second. Shut up. Mm. There's, there's, another, there's another thing here. Why can I see that now? You what? There's like another like thingy here. I can't like... There we go. Uh, I can't yeah. see inside it, but I can just see it's there. Uh, walls. Don't go, worry. I can't like go over to it. Don't worry. You've you've helped. You can't see what's inside it. You just know there's another thing there, right? Yeah, I'm assuming it's like the upper level or something. Yeah, yeah. Because there's a ladder there yeah. and there's a ladder there, roughly in the same place. Yep, yep. Oh, look how smart I am, using my brain for once. I think it's just the global elimination for it, but don't worry. Yeah, uh, it's just the case that yeah. it's uh, levels and tiers. So I'm, I'm going to watch through this window bit, until yeah. someone makes a move through the, the door. watchtower here is about 50 foot high. Dang. It's tall, it's got chains, it's rough on the outside. Can I shout at one of the devils and ask them to talk to someone who's in charge? <laughs> Oh no, why? <laughs> why? <laughs> I'm, as he does, Leave him as to he, it. I'm just like, step back. You wish. Just step back. How about, how about you go up to the door I and shout? Do it. How about you go up to the door? I'm just gonna step out to the side. On you go, Karen. Go to the door. Chap the door. Ask yeah, to speak to the manager. Go to the door. Go to the door. Up there. Go on, up to the door. <laughs> Go, go shoot, shoot. Hi, my name's Katie. I'm here with the Jehovah's Witness. Do you have a moment? <laughs> ring, 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 ring. ring. Anyone? No, ring. It's, I'm pretty sure. Not even much. Sure. You can't make that joke anymore. I'm pretty sure he's referencing that TikTok where it's the woman that has Jehovah's Witness, and the guy answers the ring and goes, "Hi, we're just having hot gay bum sex right now." And she's like, "Okay," and walks away. Oh, oh and he sends you the one. These guys with like a demon thing on. The, the Mormons door came up to the door. Aye, the door. The Mormons came up to the door. Seen them and <laughs> just walks away. I know. Send that to both of you. <laughs> no, my mum sent it. Yeah. Have you seen the one? Ricky. The uh. Like... <laughs> yeah, sir. You were gonna do something. You asked Maybe. if you could do something, and I said you could. Are you going to do it, or are you doing something else? I'm gonna. I'm gonna do something else. I'm gonna use my brains for once. I'm gonna reconvene with the uh, the uh, other cohorts here. I'm gonna let them know that I heard 
chatting behind the door, but I couldn't make out what it was. And then I'm going to see what the consensus the group wants to do instead of being the human wrecking ball. How about you just be the human wrecking wow. ball? Wow. He's a chief man. Ah, that's <laughs> my <laughs> fucking hell. I have a great idea. Go be the human wrecking ball. I <laughs> may or may not have ate like 80 milligrams of edibles about an hour ago. Well, mine's a meant to take a criminal. Would do the same, but you know, can't if I want to keep my job. You just can't stop with a pussy. It's got you there. Um, yeah, you. Okay, so, so what do we want to do, <laughs> gang? I think you should knock on the door. We should get Scooby Doo. Come on, gang, we gotta solve this mystery. So the consensus is oh, for me to do what I was gonna it. do originally. <laughs> Uh, we are such a great council of elders. Mm. Yes, right. So wait, um, okay, Matthew, question. These are windows that I'm looking through, right? There's nothing... They're windows, yep. There's there's actually like no glass or anything there. Like, one could... It looks like they... I might... There's, there's a height, though, right? About four foot. Oh, okay, it's like a step. They could come through these windows if they so wish. They could come through these windows if they so wish, yeah. Um, as could you. Okay. He's coming in the windows. Do we see a Warforged creature anywhere? Something that would look out of place amongst these devils? You're not seeing anything. Outside. Well, fuck. <clears throat> Need to go inside, fellas. Open the door, then. Yeah, yeah, I feel like that's what I'm gonna fucking be doing. That's a crazy thought. Is there a like, doorbell the just tell or a knocker on this door? Like a doorbell. <laughs> Ding dong. Uh, Ding no, dong, just a, just a full-on metal door. Uh, I'm gonna try to holler at someone to open the gate. Oh or open God. the door. You know, you know what's crazy, Matthew? What up? You could just go round and teleport straight onto the ladder. Do that. <laughs> I've earned <the> witnesses. <laughs> oh, I've done that so many times. As you <laughs> knock on the door and say something, and Barry, you can hear the creatures like look at each other, and they seem to be they seem to be having this conversation with each other. And there is like a confusion on their face. One kind of moves on over at the door. I don't and think they like the uh, witnesses. As it does, let's see here. Um, yeah, as it does, it moves on towards the door. As it opens the door, and takes a little look, turns to his mates and says something again in his language. You don't know that. <laughs> And the other, you see me all this little like, weird back and forth. You can tell by the hand gestures, they're all just a little bit confused and it's gonna looks at you and. None at all. Blocky coincidence! <clears throat> they speak an imbecile? No, why would the devil speak a imbecile? Because, I don't know, a imbecile sounds like it belongs in hell. And not the abyss? No. I don't, I don't know where. I don't know. It sounds like something that belongs in hell. I'm, I'm kind of just standing behind them, just waving, going, hello. I'm just watching the others from the distance, oh. just ready. Uh, can I ready my uh, hand crossbow? <laughs> ready it for, I wanna, I, I, ready it for I wanna what? I want to do something. Ready it for what exactly? Shove it up someone's arse. No, like, what's the trigger? You're readying it, so there, there's a trigger that's got to happen where then you would immediately fire. So what's, what's your trigger? You know, um, barring, barring you giving you the wrong pronouns. Cowboy. I'm, I'm readying it for them to misgender Ricky. Um, <laughs> hey, you I have an idea. Yes, you're up for it, Ricky. 
<laughs> I'll ready it, and then as soon as they, if they start, I guess, attacking or threatening, then I will, uh, start blasting. I, I have, I'll do you one better as well. I'll, I am holding an action as well, just in uh, my holding? hands are, I'm currently stretching my arms out as much. And if they open that door and tell us to fuck off, I'm just going to clap my hands as loud. Uh, I'm also holding an action. You kept cutting it, Cody. Oh, Cody, you're holding, you're holding what? What are you holding? Thunderclap. Thunderclap, okay. You know, so if I'm they open the door and try to be a dick, I'm just going to smile and go, Did you hear that? I'm, I'm going to hold an action. If I hear Corey's thunderclap, I'm going to Eldritch Blast. <laughs> One of these... One of these guys that I can see around the table here. Yep. This door frame is just gonna be fucked. Oh no no no! I I'm not at the door. Oh, frame. Fuck. You watch. Yeah, yeah, really Ricky, disaster is lying on you. Eldritch blast. <laughs> As they are looking around and their own little things again. Yeah, you, know, you see that they they don't they, they literally don't seem to give a fuck. There's a turtle at the door. Turtle? Oh yeah, I forgot he's a turtle. Turtle, knock on the door even harder. Oh, the door's open, I don't see him. It's not as closed. I thought you said he opened it to look at me. Yeah, what, it, and then he yeah, closed it. it. Out. Oh, cheeky little it's, shit. Quick question. If you chap quick question, if you chapped on someone's door and then started speaking French to them and they don't speak French and all you speak is French. You don't think they're going to close the door on you? I'd go get my phone and pull out Google Translate because we live in the modern age. <laughs> Ricky, Ricky. I don't think you're going to get a uh, signal down here, honestly. Parlez-vous <laughs> français? <laughs> we'll, we'll don't get a signal down here. Ricky, you gotta, you got to read the fine print here. He said that he closed the door, never locked it. Touché. <laughs> you just call me a douche. Hey, just speak French. Yes. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hello, Monsieur. My uh -huh. name is De Pardon, and I uh -huh. am prepared no more. I'm going to run away. Uh, it, appears, it appears Pepe Le Pew has opened the door. Oh, my, <laughs> name, my name is Donatello. Oui, oui. Oui, oui, baguette. Je m'appelle Donatello. Escargo. Vita the sewers. So you are sitting here at the door. What are you doing? This yeah. is a very awkward situation to watch. Yeah. This is this is painful. Rocky, what are you thinking? That uh, door I'm is trying closed, to. Uh, can I can I open this door and just like, <laughs> what the fuck? There's a little button there that you can certainly try. <laughs> that scene from The Simpsons. What's going on in your head? It's a monkey. Bang. Can you what? Can I check the button for traps? Yeah, roll an investigation check. Buttons like the movie. Where... You stick your finger in and it's gone. I've never seen Is that. The first time we actually check the traps. Um, <laughs> the investigation. You. Gives me fear of the vagina, that does. Like fucking a shark. Oh, it looks fine as you look around the door. All looks good. There's no button, there's just a handle. But it looks fine by the most, for the most part. You know, nothing looks triggered in any way. No traps in place. Fuck yeah, let's open that door. You open the door once more, like all the creatures kind of lean back and turn round as our one starts speaking in its language once more, kind of walks up to you, just starts shouting shit in your face and looks at you, waiting for a response. Then our one turns to it and kind of throws its hands up and starts kind of berating, it looks like it's berating it. It's kind of got this little quiffing quarrel as it kind of turns in and looks at you once more, Ricky, and just shrugs. This is its hand on the door and looks at you. Alright, mate. You're gonna point me in the right fucking direction, alright? Or I will kick you square in the nuts. Alright, Eric Cartman, chill You are. This Philian turtle. As you are saying that and it looks at you and once more closes the door in your face. Nithrak. 
Nefrak, open the door. Oh, why everyone English? Not even Canadian. Open the door. <laughs> okay. Open the door, Mike. I'm, I'm, if he's still by the door, I'm opening the door and I'm gonna, I'm gonna kick him right I'm just gonna put the work, right? Telewak, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna give you a really good thing. Oh, wait, oh, fuck, right. I said this before you open the door. When you open the door, if he comes running at you, cover your ears. Okay. You come okay. in, they stand there with glaives in hand, and then they look at you using the windows watch as they stand up and take their glaives and, like, hold them in a show of force outwards. <laughs> oh, I'm going to show them some force inward. <laughs> I'm gonna come over here and I'm gonna just beat the shit out of this first guy. <laughs> so, since I'm holding the action, I just thunderclap. Cool. Oh, uh, he's thunder. He's thunderclapped. I've heard it. I eldritch blast. Is you thunderclap? And nothing here needs to make a Constitution saving throw because thunderclap starts immediately next to you and goes out for like 10, 15 foot. So um, thought, wait, what is it? It's a 15 foot cube, yeah. So uh, you damage nothing. <laughs> oh, so you, I, yeah, do. On. Yes, I do. Uh, uh. It's directly from you, like this. You, let's see here. Do, do, do. No, it's, it's, it always goes in front of you. Oh, okay. So it's always placed on the square in front of you, but it can be on that round side anywhere else. So mm. We were initially aiming for doors. So technically speaking, you could have fucked over poor Ricky, but as you clap your hands, you hear the clap. Uh, I'm ain't gonna aim for the one closest to me. Yeah. And I'm just gonna dump three Eldritch Blasts until it's back. Sweet, whilst you're doing Jesus. that. <laughs> Roll initiative. Ooh. Um, I'm Ooh. also going to aim... Oh, my, I, I, me too? I know, I'm just, you know, letting I was you ready. know. Yeah. I'm gonna aim a, a, a target to the one, and then I'm gonna... Can I steady him and sneak attack? Because I have the advantage, right? Steady aim gives advantage. Oh baby, I love Okay, so I'm gonna steady aim, sneak Every attack. Day. This one right here. Ooh. What? Do one oh. of mine hit? Link. Um. Uh. again? Fourteen, twenty-four, and a sixteen. Uh, well, she guys are figuring this out. 13. I think it's uh, uh, you get to uh, all of them hit for a total of. 32 damage. Stubbs, you fired off at what one? Hand crossbow. Uh, oh, onto what one? You were firing off at what one? This one here? Um, this this one I'm hovering over. Yep, okay. For Ooh. seven, and then everybody else roll into initiative. Yeah, but I'm Would sorry, I but that's my attack before the initiative starts on the first guy. You can rock up an attack, yeah. You rock that off, and. You can rock it off. There you go. Any day now, Rocky. There we go. Ten for eight shall miss. Yes, sir. Okay. Let's uh, let's push the buttons that make the noise. <laughs> Not that one. <laughs> we don't need to hear about your skill exam report. Fish bash bush, real good goosh. Skibbity bat 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 bat. You want the weakest thing? Battery. Oh, I get another shot. I'm going to take another shot at this guy right here. And I will steady my aim, crouch down gently, and take another little plink shot at him. Cute. I supposed to rape here, Stubbs? <clears throat> That's not what I pressed. Wait, what? <laughs> Uh, there was a rapier, sir. We, we, we will need to redo that one, because that, that is not what I pressed. Let's try that again. There, there we, we go. go. It still hits. Don't forget to roll your other dice, because, you know, you're steady aiming. Steady aimed the other one, too. I don't have to roll another dice, but what? Oh, you just didn't roll for it, so I didn't take it off. I get hairy balls, my friend, not crystal ones. You can also attack now if that. you wish. I beg what to do differ. Do Just click sneak attack on your sheet. Oh. 
I'll be I thought I'd just say I'm steady aiming. Okay, never mind. Yeah, you say you're steady aiming, that's perfectly fine. But for your sneak attack, you need to click that. So I put it in your favourites. Oh. There we go. Thoy oh. Tight. The toy tight. Oh, that ain't working. Why is that not working? Oh, it's because it's got no damage. It's trying to do it. That's why. 13. There you go. Did it, Nils? No, that is everything. Let me. Oh wow, we all go up before <laughs> and then siren. <laughs> Fucked. Yeah, I'm just I'm just like ready, ready slow. I'm just there. <laughs> you might as well just take a seat. I'm just, I'm her. Corey, you're up. I don't know. No, I, 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 I'm looking at my spells to figure out which I'm gonna walk to there. Look around the room and smile. <laughs> seeing how many options I know. Cody's done nothing but play roleplay games. Have you noticed how every one of his characters walks into rooms and smiles? Yeah, I find yeah. that sort of like... Corey walks Very into happy. a room. Here's it's, the thing though, right? Have, this character you know, technically has nothing to lose. You're point. staying here, so... So, uh... Do just just point, just, point point out, just point out every time his characters walks into rooms, they smile. Yeah, no, I, I've, no, I've noticed mm. that too. <laughs> I watch too much anime. You're as predictable as a house tour. Mm. Mm. Here's the bathroom, here's the living room, here's but the sitting room. Walk into the room and as every the creature looks at you, you turn around and go, Right, you might. I I just kinda start playing a game. Watch this, he's gonna ask one of them to pick. By the toe. If it squeals, let him go. Eeny, meeny, me. Ah, it's you! Skadoosh. Uh, lightning lure, um, that there's just. a range, my friend. Yeah, that one. So let's see, you create an energy strike, one creature of your choice that you can see within 15 foot of you. Why did it have a measured template then? The fuck? Target must be within 5 feet. What? So it, no. if you read it, you create a lash of lightning energy that strikes one creature of your choice that you can see within 15 feet of you. The, 50, the thing should be placed on top of you, because it then shows 15 feet. Yeah, but you see how that, this shouldn't have that at all, this, this is something new. Because technically speaking, technically speaking, this creature is within 15 foot of him, so I don't know why that's giving you a template. We'll resolve that in its own time, but, uh, creature has to make a strength saving throw. And then, let's see, uh, the target must succeed in a strength saving throw or be pushed or pulled up to 10 foot in a straight line towards you and then take lightning damage. So, push or pull. Pill. So, 5, 10, pull towards you, and he takes... So you can't push it. Do I get an attack of opportunity? That was not welling movement, so no. So as you... That lightning flashes off and he is pulled towards you. Did anything else with your turn? Hmm, I'm looking through my bonus actions. I don't think there is. Might benefit you looking at the description of Quicken spell and your features. Mm. Sure, it's a very helpful spell. Uh, I'm blind, uh, I need to find it first. Magic. Features meta magic Quicken spell. Ah. Very useful. Where does he have sorcery points? I was spamming it last night. You've got 10 of them. I put them both ah. in your attributes under favourites. It's fun. Oh, yeah. Ah, yeah. Cool. So I'm going I'm to use this then. Okay. And. You turn any spell into a bonus action if it's an action. Cool. Um, I'm going to start waving my finger about, like, trying to make it follow my finger. Mm -hmm. I just smile and I point at him and I go, you. 
Okay, so uh, make sure you knock off those sorcery points when you click it. Yeah, it's done. Good, good. It already has. Noise, noise. Future makes a wisdom saving throw. And as he watches you ding the bell, I'm sure you're up here. Maybe he just kind of shudders a little. Um, the best boat, da. There we go. Did it now, your turn? No, sir. Yeah, no. Oh, is he Turtle Man? Hello! In Gurgak Friendland, he punch you. <laughs> Gurgak can no longer die. Gurgak is <laughs> inevitable. Gurgak has become one of the gods. Ten will miss. Uh, I'm gonna use my uh, bonus action. You have two attacks. You don't need to use bonus action, you have two attacks. A 12 for 6 hits. And then you can knock off Flurry of Blows. So. Rock off another attack, and then that would be you using a Flurry of Blows. I, I rolled a third attack. Yeah, Flurry of Blows gives you two attacks. Or are you just doing three punches as like an offhand attack? Do I get four punches then? If you use Flurry of Blows and burn a key point, yes. Yeah, okay. Alright. How many have I rolled so far? Three? Three. So you could roll one more. 18 for nine hits. And that there is... Done that for you. Did it else? Uh, um, that's my action spin. And my bonus action, correct? Yep. Can I still use my uh, with? Oh no, never mind. That's a uh, that's an action. Never mind. I am done. Okay, just a fun one here. Uh, Ricky playing a monk took a great weapon master. You know that thing that you use when you have um, great weapons like battle axes. Mm -hmm. It it said that I got to punch an enemy again after I killed one. That's the only reason I took it. <laughs> That works well, I suppose. Uh, this one here will rock in and be like, oh, dude, quest is here that isn't there. We'll go, oh, have you heard of the bard called Mike M? I oh, suck so cool. And he will make his four attacks against this one here. Um, one, two, three, power. Uh, all hit for. 9 plus 9 plus 7 plus 9, 34. So it does, sends this fucker to the Shadow Realm. Looks at yourself, goes, oh god, dude. You might suck it all. Oh, oh. And we'll turn to the turtle, my like, dude, he's a turtle. I like turtles. And FL, you are. Bye bye. And then we'll move over to the side. <clears throat> then this creature will have to dash. That technically gets him down the ladder. And as he looks, he starts screaming and shouting some really fun stuff that you just don't quite know because nobody here takes infernal and speaks it. This guy here will look at yourself, Ricky, and he will immediately stick his beard out at you and start trying to tickle you with it. Well, 23 for 7, so you know that hit. You know, you know, you know, it's too hit, and then it takes its glaive and it'll give you a little nat 20 at the face as it sticks it to you. Uh, Ricky, I think... Ha! Ah, I can do <laughs> something! You, yes! You do not need to make a con save, which is good, because you're immune to being poisoned. I believe I can use patient defense to dodge? On your turn. Oh. Some shit. I can't use it as a reaction? No, patient defense uh, allows you to uh, let me check that out. patient defense. One bonus action, spend a key point to take the dodge action as a bonus action. Spend a key point, become a monk. This one here, having seen where shit came from, well, 
jump on out the window towards yourself there, Siren. Is a big enough window with no issue. It will look at you and it will stick the beard it's battery, out. battery, not Siren. Battery? That's yeah, right. I don't know. Like he's, you both look like you are roommates. <laughs> we'll stick the beard out in your face and then we'll stick oh, you with the glaive as well. I say 24 mm. to hit and a 20 to hit. Or 15, and I need a con save from you. Fuck. Uh, oh. Good news, you're also poisoned. You cannot That's, that's not good news. Points. That's for me. This devil here will run on over and will stick its beard in Corey's face. And then take a swing with the glaive. Uh, it will hit you with the beard there, Corey. 16 for 6. I'll knock that Ow. off. I need a con save from you. A con save? Yar. Old bastard. And you two are poisoned. <coughs> you need to wash your beard, you right. dirty bastard. You know, that I think that's what's implied. One here will squeeze through the window using all of its movement to get in front of Siren as it will. It will stick its tongue out and make some rude gestures towards you before sticking a beard in your face and taking a glaive, of which both will miss one of them in that one. You shrug that off. This other one here will immediately run towards the toidle once more. We'll stick a beard in his face and then stick him with Waiting. the javelin. Uh, there is 12 points of extreme amounts of owies that you take. And then it will immediately dart on over here. This one here, standing up, well, run over towards here. And we'll attack this gimp. Oh, really? No, he's actually had to dash to do that. Shit. <clears throat> Siren, you're finally up. Yay. Uh, well, I'm you going to wake up from a nap over there. <laughs> I'm going to. Uh, Did you say I got stuck with a javelin? I'm gonna look at this one in front of me, and I'm going to. Uh, well, oh, it's gonna okay. be. Uh, you say with disadvantage for us, it's right next to me. But I'm gonna eldritch blast. Oh, give me a uh, sec. Um, keep going. Don't worry. Uh, if that hits, I'll push him back 10 feet. I don't know if it does hit or not, though. I want to check something for Ricky's sake now. Um, Checking a ruling here real quick for Ricky's sake. Hmm. Oh, I'll just ask then, does a 12 hit? It does not, no. Okay, so that's going to be another disadvantage then. Does a 24 hit? 24 does hit. Ricky's AC is off. So that's, uh, we're pushing back 10 feet back into the room. You knock him into okay. the wall. He's standing next to you. There's a five foot barrier. He gets pumped into the wall. Right. Uh, I'm a sec here, Ricky. You're unarmored. Defense yeah, I was going to mention that for you. Man. There you go. Should I be thought we would go back through the window. Okay. So thank you, sir. That wasn't really the smartest idea then. Uh, but I'll Eldritch Blast again, since I've already been doing it. That's another two. For sake. You let me check something. Just make sure. Uh, yeah, Ricky has... Everything that's hit you, Ricky's been higher than your... Oh, shit. Um, thank you for that. Nope, uh, sorry. No, five. Yeah, you were just bloody... To Everything that's hit you so far has been above that higher AC. Uh, eight. Yep. So, an eight hits guy. Oh, the, the 24 for eight hits this guy, rather. There we go. Sweet. Last thing, uh, he rocks. Good enough. Uh, I'm going to use this. Mm -hmm. 
I need to do teleport here around the corner so he cannot see me. Well, uh, just before I teleport, I just give like a little wave, like bye bye. Hmm? And then I'm gonna run up round. Yeah. And that will be my turn. Barry, you're up. <clears throat> Stops. Oh, um. <clears throat> okay, okay. Uh, I guess my only choice is. Uh... Mm. Not much choice. Uh... This guy is so close, I can really smell his beard. It's um, quite foul, honestly. Uh, let me. Take my rapier and try and give him a little shave, shall we? Instead of trying to throw it at him this time. Rapier is a pointy weapon, but sure. Whatever, I'm stabbing it into his fucking beard. <laughs> uh, let's see, uh, when poisoned this way, so uh, for yourselves, poison, just so you're aware, you have disadvantage on attack rolls and ability checks, so 15 still hits. Oh, fuck. Okay. Uh, I'm immune to poison. Yep. And uh, if I move, he gets an attack, right? I have a graph for that. Would you like to see my graph stubs? Talk about it in tiny. Hey. Go fuck yourself. You can put the graph away. I know it very well. <laughs> Find it. Fuck your Matthew, graph. Matthew, just, just out of curiosity, what, what does the graph say? Well, well, well. You say, right here, mate. Right here. On the, the Y axis, you got fuck around. I got some zero to ten. And then on the well, I thought that's his find out. <laughs> I know where you live. Where do we find? He says, "Fuck around, never find out." Fuck around, never find out. We know for a fact that's like getting cut out of the group. Check in the car and call. Jason, are you all right, son? Because your scout's yeah. accent's pish. Um, I shall then use a bonus action. To disengage. Mm -hmm. I am fucking about, but I shall not find out. Yeah. And I'm going to move over to the ladder. Oh wait, what? Clyde's with the wall. No oh, fucking doesn't he? Oh no, there is technically a wall in there, but you're gonna jump through. There you go. Oh, okay. Oh fuck, he's guarding the. F oh shit, I didn't see him before. Never mind. Uh, That's right. Is there anything else? Uh, I'm just going to move over to this corner then. <laughs> oh, fuck. Hey, stop. Do me a favor. Uh, just, just for your own benefit, go into your features and look at fancy footwork. Cody, you're up. Okay. It's okay, bro. Hang on. Right, so, uh, I'm sitting here realizing. Scale. For my own safety, I am going to uh, do a magical new spell for myself, and I'm gonna. I'm hoping this is correct. Oh, okay. I'm gonna jump to there. Dimension door. Uh, yep. I'm then gonna cast that one. And then I'm gonna look over towards. What one attacked me? It was that one, wasn't it? That was one of them, I don't quite remember. Ah, it was that one, that's the first one that came in the chain of. Uh, that, that. I've got the name it. Uh, right, so I'm gonna aim for that one with a good old fashioned. Ska. Oh wait, I can do it at a higher level. No, you can't. Ooh. No, you can't. No, you can't. I thought you were going to do this. Well. You cannot cast two leveled that. spells in your turn if one is an action and one is a bonus action. Therefore, whatever you were thinking, think of something else that isn't a leveled spell. Oh, baby, 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 baby. Come on, firebolt. Bastard. I mean, technically speaking, that was a, a good save, but uh, a 10 for 12 will sadly miss. 
I just scorched the wall. Can we just talk about how Cory did not take Fireball as a third level spell and that that is like... That's tragic. That's, that's, that's determination. I'll be honest, I didn't actually see it when I looked for the uh, yeah. spells. Special. Special. Oh, he has a, what do you call it? He has a sorcerer. Divine Soul Sorcerer, so it may be something to do with that. But as you click it off and it scorches the wall, did it announce your turn? Giving him the finger and smiling. He smiles a lot, He always got a creepy smile on your face. See, to be fair, if you're Cody and you look like a paedophile, you need to have a creepy smile on your face. Fuck off. I was gonna say it's, I was gonna say it's a paedophilic tendency, you beat me to it. <laughs> I mean, it'd be cool if you could deliver a fucking punchline that sh** and everything. It'd be cool if you could I finish the sentence. Like, out. <laughs> yeah, like, that is me. <laughs> you cut out, I had to half for that. Every Shut second word went- every second word went to the fucking abyss. <laughs> Ricky, you're up. Yes, sir. Alright, mate. So, I warned ya. I told ya. Now I'm gonna deliver. So, I'm just gonna <laughs> give him a good old, uh... Good <laughs> Australian Amazon delivery. Oh, hey. <laughs> oh, he got the clothes. Yep. He's got the clothes. You rip out the claws and start taking a little shripping rip at this guy here. Um, Didn't even know that was bad claws. You give him the little owies and he is like, you know, he seems to shrug that off quite a bit. Give him a little bit of a bad touch. All right, I'll give him a left. It'll give him a right. Give him a little, little, little. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna insult your intelligence, there, buddy. I think the two uh, X is. Tell you everything you need to know. Definitely missed that one. All right, I'm gonna activate my flurry of blows now. Okay, make it click off. Okay. It's Nineteen for seven does hit. All right, and then I'm gonna use the fall or the what's the open hand technique he needs to. Make a deck saving throw. Against? Or, what? What's this thing you're using? Call, uh, it's, uh, oh, 13 is the DP. It's literally called open hand technique. Uh, when you get a creature player blow, you can impose the... Okay, oh, thank you so much, sir. Oh, yeah, sorry about that. Juicy. If you're not prone, it must make a strength saving throw or... You push it. Okay, so you want it to make a dexterity saving throw or else you fall prone. Yeah. Um... And your attacks are classed as magical for the purpose, so he saves. Did it announce your turn? Uh, I have an ability called Extra Attack where I can attack twice instead of once. Yep, you already done that with two separate claw attacks as a 25 for 6 and a 9 for 9. Oh. You've then Flurry of Blows and used one attack, you can make another attack as part of that Flurry of Blows if you wish. Sure, can I do that with my claw? Sure. 22 for 4 and as you sink that in, he, he's taking it but like it's not doing as much as you'd think it would do. Uh, would this also trigger the open hand technique to make him make a deck save? Um, or is that only a uh, once per ability thingy? To me, that reads as only once. It says whenever you hit with one of your flurry of blows, and not whenever you hit with a flurry of blow. Ah, so yes, it's sir? given a number. That's the way I'd read it. Perfect. Makes sense to me. Uh, that should be uh, it for my turn then. Okay, it was so weird having players that don't try to argue every little thing. So, oh yeah, no, nope, that makes sense. Where have you guys been <laughs> all my life? I got a touch of the tism, man. I can understand all sides of the argument. I was gonna say the only reason I ever uh, be like, oh no, I don't, uh, or I argue it, it's just because I genuinely don't understand because I'm special. <laughs> Both you and C High are open hand monks. <clears throat> Did he? <laughs> Ow! Ow! These are both the fucking same! Shit! 
I should have went. I should have made the avatar. I should have went with elements. But I was like, I I, I want to Bruce Lee the shit out of people. The best one is the dragon. The dragon one. I can't remember what it's called. But the we dragon have the ascended cool dragon. One. Yeah, that one. That That's one's cool. So good. He's gonna take uh, this one here. It's, just the panda. it's literally just comes the panda. Let's see. I'm gonna make this quick and easy it. for myself. Uh, speaking of quick and easy, uh, Corey, how are you doing? What? Ooh. What? Ooh. What? I wasn't lost. Now, be honest. That's okay. Just called you quick and easy. That's fine. He's got a plus ten to hit. Oh, the math is the math works out well. Plus ten, and then the damage die is a d six. So I was, was going to roll this by hand a lot easier. Um, so fucking character name Jesus, Gumby. Plus ten to hit and plus six. Damage. So, he's gonna take this guy that he's targeting. Uh, 16 and a 6. So, both hit. 1, 3, 12, 13, 14, 15 damage. Hits the boy. He'll then immediately turn around and bust off the flurry of blows, which has just a single key point. Correct me if I'm wrong, Jason. One key point, yep. What's that? What's Flurry of Blows. So then take the other one, an 11 blood. and a 4. Live around a 14, both hit. Live around a 4, 3, 5, 8. 8 plus uh, 12, 20 damage on this guy here. And then he will look at them and go, Yo! And move the Chain Devil. Whoa. Yeet. You gotta make a name. Yeah, yeet. 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 He will. Yeah, uh, yeet. Oh, I'm about to make a nail for myself. Let's see, yeah, but so 30 foot. Yeah, it's always like... been a gravestone. Yeah. <laughs> King Devil looks a bit kinky, looks a bit funny. He will. Take some steps. Let me check his chain. His chain. Uh, oh, he's got reach. Ho oh, oh, ho oh, ho. Kinky as fuck. He's got a company here. Uh, let's see. Gonna go ahead and throw a chain towards yourself there, Corey. A twelve Is it? hits. Nope, misses. Twelve misses. Yeah, I'll say it definitely misses. And then he will look at uh, your gal battery and we'll throw a chain towards her and eleven will miss. We'll move over to the bearded devil oh. here. Bearded devil. I, I look I look over at him and go. Bearded devil will turn around and kick towards our poor little turtle. Uh, Ricky, can I have a athletics or dexterity check, please, to not be not prone? Yes, you can. Athletics or what was the other one? Acrobatics. Can I you are fine. Is he's going to go ahead and whack you with the glaive in return, which will miss as he swings that round after trying to kick. This guy here will very sadly climb in through the window, and as he does, we'll just. Give a little disheartened sigh. This guy here will run, he will come out, say, having. Wait, do I, do I not get opportunity of attack for that? No, why would you get opportunity of attack? Because he came out of nowhere into my sight or whatever? They need to leave you willingly. Oh, I thought it was if they come into it only or leave it willingly. That's only with the polearm master feet. Ah, okay, okay. This guy here sees Siren. Siren, you're still technically under that Raven's Queen blessing as well, ain't you? Am I? You teleported, and it's at the end of your turn, so he will go ahead and swap it up and up with the beard. He'll hit you with his beard, which is a miss, and then he'll immediately swing around with yeah. the glaive, which is a 19 for 12, and as he does, it does not do as much damage as you think it would. Hitting you for half. What's the glaive saying? Oh, shit. Um... Can I have a constitution saving throw, please? What if I don't want to be damaged by whatever this is? <laughs> you are perfectly fine and you are not hit with whatever this is. L. Another L creature, did. use watch, will then fly down the stairs. When I say fly, I mean he 
flutters down gracefully. However, he looks um, like Stubbs, so there's nothing really graceful oh. about that. It's it's over there. Oh, I thought you meant like, like, oh, you, me. you said stairs, so I thought you would mean like out I here. Mean, I was yeah. thinking, what the fuck? Nope, that's on me. Don't worry. This dude come from? <laughs> I was just thinking, where's this dude come from? I didn't see him. He, he will... looks like a booger with wings. He'll give a little, <laughs> give a little hearty <laughs> chuckle in his he will. will look directly at yourself there, uh, Corey, and as you will, he'll place his hands towards you and use some really funny words, magic man. I require me. you- Yep. You sure? Positive. Okay, so he, he just went, I'm gonna- Yeah. Yeah, why not? As why, fuck? Why, why can't it like that? Corey? As he fuck. Corey, I need you to make a charisma check. Check, not saving throw. Your counter spell fizzles. I need you to make a wisdom saving throw. Motherfucker. Ooh. Not 20, please. Bastard. Corey, you are dominated by this creature. <laughs> how the fuck? Wait, how the fuck did I get a nat <laughs> one in charisma when it's my base? Uh, because you because, can still uh, roll a one on the dice. That's a bullshit. Also, also Corey, because you just to got bent over and fucked. Someone. Oh yeah, Cody did just get bent over and fucked, and he became the Amnesia's bitch. Cody. He is the new chin. You are mm -hmm. beguiled. You I don't know what that means. That's too big of a word. Harmed. You view all the devils here. Mainly, wait, I see all the devils. If you view the Amnesia here. Big guy. You view him as friendly. You wouldn't attack him. He has advantages on saving throws against you for being charmed. He is a telepathic link between you and him. Um, he can issue you commands without any action, and you must do your best. You do your best to obey it. It can be something simple, such as attack that creature, run over there, fetch that object. Um, the creature completes it, and doesn't receive further action from you, it defends itself to the best of its ability. Uh, what else? Yikes. You can use your action, me, to take total and precise control of the target until it ends. Meaning I can tell you to literally do anything I want. Each time you take damage, you must make a wisdom saving throw. Alright. Corey. Yeah? The Amnesia would like you to attack Siren. The bearded devil will come in. Good luck with that, Corey. Attack with Siren what? is all it said. Okay. You do whatever you wish on that one there. The bearded devil's going to come in here. It's going to go ahead and it's going to try and hug you, Stubbs. It's going to try and give you a, a big old bear hug. It require athletics Aww. or acrobatics. What? Uh, Jesus, a hug? Oof. Athletics or acrobatics? Either one will suffice. Is this saving? No, just athletics or acrobatics is a skill check. Mm. In Gurgak country, we hug him back. No, for fuck's sake. <laughs> uh, you save, you're fine. So it's gonna throw the beard at you. <laughs> Actually, what in the... my country, we'd break can their I, like... spine first, but they cannot hurt us. Can I counter that at all? Uh, look at your sheet and see what you've got, whilst I check to see how this interferes with poisoned. Is that a missile? Um, no, it's just a beard. Poison creature. No, it's just a beard. <laughs> <laughs> Well, oh. porcupines can jettison their beard whisker things, so I didn't know. Maybe he could, like, hurl one out of that bitch. Does he look like a porcupine to you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look at those little tentacles on his chin. He could, like, fire one of those out. Stubbs, you take a 19 for 6. I just injured myself. The fuck? 
<laughs> Wait, 19 for Nailed 6, it. how much damage is that? 6 damage. 6 damage. <laughs> oh, okay, I'll, I'll, I'll take it. Of course you will. Good girl. <laughs> that sounded so Bat creepy. Battery likes it. It's fine. <laughs> Battery enjoys it. Yeah. That's how so close you do. Sorry, the fat con made me say that. Fairy Devil here will take a look at Gumby and he will go ahead and make a cleave and a beard attack against him. This motherfucker has a 17 AC, an 18 AC rather, so it just straight up misses. We then move over to this one here. He's going to go ahead and do the same. 1847 does, however, hit. It hits. And then he will be bearded as well. 1947 also hits, and then he needs to make two saving throws. A 13 and a 13. Wow, fated that he does not get poisoned. Siren, you're up. He watches the swings and the swangs and the weird ass creatures come out. Not oh, looking good, breath. Yeah, well, uh, this this blob-looking bitch. He still hasn't moved yet, has he? He's just nope. right over there. Sweet. I was gonna say because uh, earlier on you said uh, someone was hugging Stubbs, and I'd missed the miss part of it. And I was just like, "Hey, a second, he's moved over to Stubbs." I was like, just really confused for a second. That's that's just me being special. It's okay. Not you, Matthew. You're perfect in every way. I know I am. <laughs> God. Uh, right. Uh, what spell do I want to use? Hmm. What spell seems like a funny haha moment? I was about to say you have spells, completely forgetting that you're a warlock. Yeah, funny enough, you know. We get these things called, like, patrons, and they, like, give us magic. Kind of helpful. Uh, thinking maybe this one. Let me read it real quick. What oh, one? no, that's the wrong one. That one. Uh, what one? Thinking psychic, thinking psychic lance. Just maybe. Psychic lance is fucking powerful. Maybe. It is. It's very powerful. And it's upcasted, so it's eight d six. Exactly. Oh, I, I did forget about that. So yeah. Oh, actually, what's that one? Oh, that's D4. It's it's got a cool like secondary part to it, but it's D4. So, uh, so yeah, I'm gonna psychic lance that bitch. Twenty-seven. Did you know twenty-seven is below the average, but only just? Yeah. Twenty-eight yeah. is the average, but as you hit this bitch with a intelligent saving throw. <laughs> Are you intelligent? Is oh, he he's, intelligent? He's intelligent. Yeah. One of the few creatures that's intelligent. He will... Hey. Intelligent doesn't mean he's smart. True. Beats it, beats it. Fucking hell. So he takes half damage. He's still gonna roll a con save. He does. So half of the 27 is... Does, it just wants a DC 10. Sweet. Uh, natural 7, he saves. Okay, well, you know what? It's going to be a really smart thing to do now. Run away. <laughs> We're going to use this. Bye bye! Uh, that's my turn. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, mm. you dumb right. fucking whore. Ah, you dumb little bitches. Um, okay. Can I steady him as, uh, with a rapier? Yes. Oh. Really weird, but yeah. Technically speaking, it allows that shit. Okay. Like a repose kind of stance. I'm going to... Very steadily. Steady aim. And I'm going to sneak attack with my rapier. I'm going to stare right in this guy's eyes and be... You want to hug me? Hug me, big man. Whoa. I'm going to stick this right deep up your dickhole. What? 
Oh, fuck. Right in the jack's eye. Matthew, please, censor this bitch. Please. I can't. I've tried. <laughs> so, There's no censoring battery. So, let's see. That would have been a straight roll, technically speaking. So, I'll just let you know if it's a straight roll and you roll, and you roll wrong, we take the left hand number. So, that would have been a 17 plus 10 for 27 to hit. But no matter. Um, he takes 27 points of damage. I would imagine oh, so dick. sticking that up his dick hole. Sounding. Did not enough in the turn? Steady aim means you and can't then move. battery is gonna... Steady aim means Oh, you... I can't move? Oh, fuck. Just all oh, yeah, there. I forgot about that. Okay. Never mind. Is that how they put a piercing in there? there? <laughs> I'm just... Battery's just gonna stand there and just cross her arms and stare him in the face as he's screaming it's there in like pain. Corey, you've been giving your orders. <laughs> mm -hmm. I turn around to look at Jabba. Bow my head, smile. That's a mirror. Once again. <laughs> Why is he always fucking smiling? I don't know. I then close my eyes, take a big deep breath. Do you know where he is? Fine. How'd, how'd you know where I am? I see you running through the fucking windows, dumbass. Yeah, but you don't know. Where yeah, here's the thing, right? So I see you run past this window, this window, but you don't run past this window, which makes me think you're there, dumbass. Mm. And or in doing so, I, good I logic. Motherfucker, if I teleported you there, I would have seen you go past and that window. Because you've already teleported the way once, you can't use another action. Bonus mm. action, but you did run Still past windows, to be fair. You what did. He did run past uh, so, uh, windows. There, is, there are capabilities to teleport further than that. That is not okay. a bonus type for anything. I'm pretty sure Wildcard okay. Rogue get that. Okay. Pretty cool, actually. He did run That's past windows, though, so I gotta give him that one there. I just wanna know how himself. Yeah, no. Thunderclap. Con saving throw. At DC 16, okay. What aim? Your ears are gonna hurt. You take uh, eight thunder damage, and you start going map like it's Archer. Then it else you turn, Cody. No, sir. Okay, yeah. let me just check dominate yeah. person for you, yeah. just for your own benefit. Yes, Stubbs. Oh wait, I, I get what you're doing there. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Uh, Coward. Okay. Um. Oh yeah, you're just fucked until you take damage. So hypothetically, right? Don't when I take damage, will I then know that I was... Only if you fail the wisdom saving throw. So when you take damage, you'll make another wisdom saving throw. And if you f if you pass that wisdom saving throw, then you know you were dominated. Good, okay. Let's hope I pass it then. Let's put it, let's put it this way. I'll help you to get figure that out. <laughs> I'll help you. Ricky. Yes, sir. Okay. So I'm going to lock eyes with the, uh, the one guy who, uh, bewildered fuck nuts there. And I'm going to say, listen here, mate. You can't be bewitching my guys. That's not the proper thing to do. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to punch this guy in the face real quick. <laughs> <laughs> 13 for 8, oh, does <laughs> Again, so I'm going to claws... continue kicking the shit out of this guy. And then oh, I'm going to come oh. over there and I'm going to kick the shit out of you. You claw it. You see that you're, you're, you're not doing as much as you think you're doing. Oh, I'll get in there. I fucking love this puddle. Oh, no. <laughs> We're just gonna activate flurry of blows. Fifteen for nine hits. We're gonna knock him prone if he fails a deck save. I love how Ricky's slowly turning into fucking uh, Russell Crowe from South Park. Natural nineteen. <laughs> He's just fighting around the world. <laughs> Might move, he's making favorites out and round well. 
listen here, you wee little gob chite. I'll use whatever accent I feel is necessary. You one more attack, my guy. <laughs> oh shit. Uh ka chow. What? What did you do? Whip your dick out and flash him? Sixteen for seven. Hey. Did it not your turn if you hit? Uh yeah, that, that'll be me. Hey, I'm putting in the work, but I don't feel like this guy's going down, man. It's going down. I'm yelling to burn. Twenty. You better thank you. Question, Matthew. Wawa. See how I'm under control, Jabba. Yeah. Am I still like somewhat cognitive, or do I only? You remember everything that happens. No, I mean, like, in my current state, am I only allowed to do what? Yeah, he has, or, you're uh, dominated, he has like, full control, but he, like, so he can be as granular or as loose as he wants. So I could tell you, for example, take Siren, hit Siren with a Psychic Lance and then Quicken Spell to Rear Frost. Mm. Or I could just tell you, or I could just tell you to fuck Siren. Siren up. Yeah. Okay. So you've essentially just said fuck Sire not under any circumstances? Yeah, because then it's up awesome. to you. Awesome, I still have somewhat cognitive then. 13 and 17 both hit here in the flurry of blows. 1, 5, 6, 6, 12, 18 points of damage to this guy here. And he will also reposition to come round. Now I circle this bitch. This guy here will... Walks on over to here, gets between both of you, and he's gonna be like, you know, hi, hi, hi. And he's gonna take a chain towards Stubbs. Firstly, 27 to hit yourself, Stubbs. Uh, let's see here. So oh. the target is grappled. Why are you hitting yourself? Why are you hitting yourself? Why are you hitting yourself? So let's see, target is grappled. Mm, big man, if you want me to do that, I've got a whip in my backpack. I'm ready. So you are now gonna hit this one here and hit you with the good old restraint. <laughs> so now you can't move. Mm, just how I like it. You have to use your action to escape. It is a DC 14. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> and you take 15 points of alleys. I'm going to rip the chain over towards uh, Gumby. It's a 15 for 11. And there's already a grapple in place, so he is not grappled. We're gonna move over to the beard double the beard double's gonna come in this little guy here. As he sees you, he's gonna stick the glaive into you. That is a 13 for 5, that will miss. He'll then stick the beard in your face. 17 for 8, which I believe just hits. Yep, 17 for 8 will just hit. You take a beard to the face, sir. Uh turtles and beards, man. So I'm worried about them. This guy here. Right. He's gonna walk on over to Gumby. As he does, he's gonna go ahead and uh, stick the beard and the shit in Gumby. Uh he taketh the 21 for 4 and then makes a constitution saving throw. He fails the constitution saving throw and he is now poisoned. I'm going to check these poisoned conditions Very by cool. the way. Oh, uh, Stubbs, you can, if you wish, make, uh, as well as you, Corey, uh, you can both make, give me two constitution saving throws. Are you two? Yeah, because I forgot you can make this save at the end of your turn. So you're no longer poisoned as of your second, Corey. And battery, you're no longer poisoned as of your first. So Sweet. He's a crown there, no longer poisoned. Does mean you can be poisoned again, but yeah. And if oh. you are this fucking idiot. Um, oh, he can't be poisoned because he's a monk. He's now immune to being poisoned due to being that level. Forgot that monks have that shit. I'm also immune because I'm a turtle. <laughs> that too. I like turtles. I like turtles. I like turtles. I like turtles. Dash, you come over here. <laughs> yeah, music will step into the center of the room, step on the table, and then fly. How much movement do you use? 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. People then levitate an additional 10 foot into the air. 
and give a good old hue 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 ha 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 and make some noises. <laughs> ah, the shit that this guy can do. Would anybody like to know a secret? No, because I don't know a secret. Ah, this guy's done this. This creature hit a guy in that 20 and instantly killed him. Oh, God. I was using oh, the, this I was using this the was original the perfect version. time for Jason to go for a piss. I was using the original version. It's been nerfed since then. And also the Avernus guys were level 8. These have a lot more health than that. These are good. Uh, this guy here is going to once... Uh, you know what? He's going to try to shove battery to the ground. Because, you know... Uh, God forbid. Let's see. You want to go ahead and make for me the appropriate uh, uh, dexterity or... Uh, sorry, acrobatics or athletics? Who? Uh, Battery. Mm, acrobatics, it shall be. Let's check here. Um, okay. Uh, you are good. He's not very happy with that one there, so you'll go ahead and... Oh, he has reach as well. Why Harry's he... just going to look at him and smile and lick her lips. Like, mm -hmm. going to take a step back, you fucking creep. <laughs> and he's going to stab you with his glaive. Oh. 22 for 10. Shit. Why is... Oh, because you're... Cause you're the, I keep forgetting that you're a changeling. Guys, here going to look at Gumby. He's going to be like, you know, Armagerd. And he's going to hit him with the beard. Uh, so 22 for 10, and he's going to hit him with the glaive. That is a 17. Brother's AC is 18. Oh, yeah. Uh, it takes that, and constitution saving throw means nothing, because poison. We move over to Siren. Siren, you get one guy behind you, and one guy in front of you. Man, it's just like being at the club. Sounds like a good Saturday. Dyson. Hello. You're up. Oh, okay. Okie dokie. Come on, Mike. So, what I'm going to do, right? Wait, is, all right, all right. See, see this fucking mm -hmm. bitch ass looking motherfucking bitchy boo boo bitch over there? Yar yar. Right? Yeah. Uh, he can get to fuck. Uh, bada bing. Mm hmm. Bada boom. Mm hmm. Go fuck yourself. Corey, so I'm gonna do you all the damage in one go. Let me check. Can you do that? You said. I did. By however, the instructions. However. By any means necessary. However, there's something specific about reactions in this spell. Um, so give me a sec. Uh, so I have to cause the creature. That's, that's only Grindler. Uh, so which of those three attacks are you hitting with Silvery Barb? So it can only be one of them. The second one. Jason, slash R, 1d20. Uh, second. My game's just frozen, I'm coming back in. Ah. Uh. Oh, okay, back in. Right, uh, so, slash r one d 20 That's 18. Suck it. You missed, bitch. No, he hits. He has a plus 10 to hit. That's eight. an 18. <laughs> oh, you can't. <laughs> he, a oh, he actually, I um... Oh, my screen's black, though. He rolled lower yeah. on the dice, but still hit you. So Corey, you're about to take 24 points of good owies on force, okay. Then, mm. then, you get to make three constitution saving throws. Sorry, not, con not constitution, sorry, my bad. Wisdom saving throws. Uh, so your wisdom is... Right, corn it doesn't happen. How can I just use the dice? Because it shows me the number. You gotta make three. Miss. Fail. 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 You still dominated. Uh, how, how high do I need to go? 
Oh, for Matthew, this, you're gonna need a nat 20. Oh, my screen is uh, kind of black at the minute. I can't really see much. Uh, don't like worry, do you wish to do anything else with that turn? Is there anything else you'd be thinking you were gonna do? Uh, I was gonna use movement and uh, use my uh, Blessing of the Raven Queen again. Movement to where? Uh, well, I was going to Blessing of the Raven Queen inside evaluate the situation and then go from there right i can i can do that for you just now like it's, it's like the map is just black i just can't it's just probably taking a moment to load no i mean like i'm in the server and everything can do any, everything it's just the map isn't oh showing anything that is it green squares by chance Share your screen, Jason. Share your screen. Uh, I can. I'm on my phone for a. Uh... Right. Uh, sweet. Uh, I'm then gonna run back outside, like through the door. Ten. And then. 20, Twenty-five. To the bottom of the stairs is twenty-five foot. Uh, I'm gonna like no, just like run to like the first the top stairs on the left and then jump down and come like just to the corner point of that wall 15 so you're using like, 20 foot of movement to out. jump down at the corner yeah so like it's you know the you know the corner that's like in between the in between the uh like the one we're in and the upper level yep. sort of thing that like there ish go go move I am like, no wait is there, is there anything else uh, no, that'll be me. Larry. Oh, there's a lot of blood here. Uh, am I still tied up? Am I still chained? I am. You're still stuck in the chains. You would have to use oh. your action to bust them. <laughs> she knows how to bust something. Oh. Bust the nut. <laughs> Ah, uh, fuck. Okay, um, I'll roll a d20. Just roll a d20 for... Um, let's see here. Uh... It's gonna be a strength... I think strength saving. Oh, even better. Yeah, I'm gonna say strength saving throw. DC is 14. Oh, fuck. Do you okay. bust them? Uh, let's see here. You still have your entirety of movement. Sweet, sweet. Okay. I am going to bust the fuck through this window. Yeah. You jump through the window. Okay. And hide around this corner. Yep. And regular potion of healing, that's just that uh, regular that's bonus potion. Action, right? Regular potion, yeah. So that's bonus. You can chug that shit. Fuck, yes. Damn. Oh, oh fuck. thank fuck. You drink the liquid as you Oof. do. It is acrid and disgusting. Not how it normally mm. tastes. It tastes more like ash in your mouth. Than a liquid. Mm, I'm not going to lie, I've had worse, but it tastes a little off. Did I know? No, I'm. Uh, I'm going to hope I'm safe here for now. Corey. Hello, my friend. How doing? Uh, I'm gonna just do my uh, rinse and repeat. Gonna go a little bit different this time. Uh, time in Shondor. Technically, I can see it, so right to there. And he can actually see your token as three quarter cover as well, so. I'm gonna I'm do this one. Skadoosh. How'd you know I'm there? He could actually see your I token. I can see the window. Your token could actually be seen through the door on three quarters cover. Oh, so I couldn't see him. That's how angles work, Jason. You're in the military. You should yeah. know that by now. Yeah. 
Pyth no, I just, I just, like, from my position, I couldn't see him, so that's like, ah. Oh. Pythagoras and all that shit. Hello, hi, and welcome to the advert. So this is probably going to be a good time to go ahead, pause, maybe take a break. However, we do have a few little things that we should discuss. So, firstly, we are still available on Patreon, and we are still available on Coffee. Links are in the description. Uh, there is now some stuff up there that you can buy and also get for free. Just a kind of way to support and all the rest of it. And I will be adding more stuff as updates come to the map making software. So do keep a little lookout for that. Now, once again, we are still partnered with Adventure on. Their link is in the description if you want to play D&D. With absolutely no strings attached, uh, be that with some one shots, some fun little games, or even some smaller campaigns, by all means, just join below. A link in the description. Uh, you may see games run by myself. So, the schedule. We've had to write this down. So, firstly, here's the times. 8pm Central European, 7pm GMT, 2pm Eastern Standard, 1pm Central Standard, and 11am Pacific Standard. For all the games you're about to hear, that is the days that they will go live on YouTube where you can watch the videos. Now on Monday, it's Icewind Dale Rain with the Frost Maiden with some familiar faces. On Tuesdays, we have Baldur's Gate Descent into Avernus. On Thursdays, we have a level 1 through 20 Vecna Eve of Ruin with some other little homebrew and some official modules in there as well. So keep a little eye out on that one. And on every second Saturday, we have Fandelver and Below, the Shattered Obelisk, where I am the player and not the DM. That one is going swimmingly. And now I'm going to pass it over to Past Me with the Longer Hair to tell you about Dungeon the Mad Mage. Now, for our live games, we have Dungeon the Mad Mage. Now, if you are in the US, that is on a Friday night, and if you're basically anywhere else in the world, it's a Saturday morning. So, uh, if you are in the US, it is 5 p.m. Pacific, 7 p.m. Central, 8 p.m. Eastern. If you're anywhere else in the world, such as myself, that's 1 a.m. UK GMT, 2 a.m. Central European Standard Time, and 9 a.m. Hong Kong time because uh, Ronan is on that time so we'll include it for uh, anyone in that time zone. So yeah, uh, that about is everything. Let's get back to it. So I'm going to... kind of wallow and why he gets his toes blown off. <laughs> I'm, dan I'm, I'm, I'm doing a little jiggy dan port. Point over and go. Skadoosh. Dexterity saving throw. Oh, Brother in Christ! Death by a thousand paper cuts incoming, I assume. Doing anything else with your turn? Do you no, sir. Fire off, you give a little dance. Dirtle! Back in a second. Ricky, you're up. Yes, yeah, sir. You're done, boy. Hello, mate. Good night. Uh, get real tired of this guy not taking damage. Tell you that much for free. Da, 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 da. I'm going to use my action to use my wholeness of body to restore 30 of my hit points. Okay. I'll smash that one for you just now there, sir. You feel good with your 30 hit points coming in? Take a little stretch. And then I'm going to use the what I'm what I'm good for. I'm gonna throw a flurry of blows. Flurry of blows requires you to make an attack before you can do it. After you take an attack, okay. Uh. Uh. Hmm. uh can I use a key point for anything? Oh, let's find out. Uh, shield pinch. Uh, 
Oh, I guess I could activate patient defense now, right? Yeah, you can patient defense. That means the attacks no. on you will have disadvantage. You Three. patiently wait. Did it else return? Uh, I believe that should be it for me. Die. Run over to this monk here who doesn't realize the shit that he's been able to do. Uh, I'm gonna take the first one there. A uh, two for twelve misses, and then straight away with a twelve for six, seven damage on this guy here. Sends him to the abyss. Well, crack a lack, smack a dack, a flurry of blows. Uh, so it's gonna knock off for that key point again, and he will eleven hits, four, six, ten. They're gonna walk up to this bitch here. Oh, I better do something real fucking stupid. It's gonna attack the Amnesia. 17 to hit, will miss. That's fucking spicy. Chain Devil will hmm. walk on up so over here. We'll give a little bow, kiss the air, do all that good shit. And it will try and cuddle you, Ricky. I'm gonna go ahead and request one athletics or acrobatics as he tries to hug the turtle. I got you, buddy. I'm gonna do a little Deadpool jump in the air and then do like a little splits move. And you pass. He does not grab you like that, so he then proceeds to throw the chain at you to try and split the testicle. A 13 for 19 will miss. Move over to this bearded devil here, who is not very happy with that one there. Sticks the beard in your face and then takes the glaive towards yourself. A 19 for 10 on the beard. And so you're like, oh Jesus Christ, fuck this guy. Who's Jesus? This chain devil is going to stand there looking around like, the fuck, man? Was that at disadvantage? You know, my friend, it was not. I'll let me re-roll that immediately. A uh, natural 18 on the die instead. So the fo natural 14 for 19 is what hits you in the end. Guy here will jog round to trunk through the front door. <laughs> it's his fat day today. <laughs> This guy here, a cute little guy, funny guy. Um, well, that's a fun one. It's been a while since I've seen anything to it. Uh, oh, I didn't realize that was a thing. I gotta remember things more. Okay. Okay. Uh, he will look at you, Ricky, and as he does, see just one word, whilst he's concentrating on the spell, he'll look at you and he will say, run. I need a wisdom saving throw from you, Ricky. Yes, sir. Uh, is this like a charm or anything like that? No, it's a sure. command spell. Okay. Wisdom. Wisdom. Saving throw, you said? Yep. Uh, as you fail that save... Uh, Can I use my uh, luck to re-roll that? Sure, sure. Let's one d20. Fuck. Okay, cool. On your turn, when it comes to your turn, you will run. Before you do anything else, you will expend all of your movement. Devil here will walk up to our boy and he will glaive and beard fuck out of him. Both of which will miss. Move over to Siren. Siren, you've been harassed by that pervert you met a few hours ago. <laughs> this, this, this bloke up here, you know, don't like him too much. I don't like him too much. To be fair. Oh, heck, please curse. Uh, 
and then we're gonna just spam Eldritch Blast again. Yup, yup, yup. If I recall correctly, do you not also have Repelling Blast? Oh yeah, I do. No, you don't. So oh, you do. Yeah, Repelling Blast, so... Back each hit can move, can move Corey 10 feet away. But yeah, if you want to rock him, shock him, robot. 14 oh, for shit. 14. 29 for 9. That's a brick. Yep, so don't worry. Um, okay, so give me a sec. Because I am dead. 14 plus 9. Roll another d10 for me. Uh, another d10. That is a d10. 5. Plus 5. So, plus, uh, hold on. Plus the bonus of damage. Which is plus four. Bonus yeah, nice. Okay. So, here's where it gets real fun. He does go down. Unconscious. You know he's unconscious. Hmm. Okay. Do you... Still make that third attack, or do you leave it at that? What do you do? <laughs> do you kill him or not? Well, well, hmm, hmm. This is a difficult decision. This is a difficult decision because he's staying here anyway, you know. Hmm. Uh. And he has been, you know, kind of pissing me off by like doing his like, I dimension door and attack you again. And it's like, no, bitch, I don't like that. Want one cry about it? Cody, okay, yeah, he's did, getting that, Cody, he's getting you that did, back shot. You did also. You had to make a wisdom saving throw for the first attack because it did not knock you on your ass. Mm. So you can make a wisdom saving throw there. Okay. Then the second one comes in, so you can still make, even though you're unconscious, you still can make that other one. <laughs> so you are no longer dominated. But you're also unconscious. That's great. That's great, though. He's getting that back shot. Then, re the then roll. controlled by someone else. Roll a D. What you call it? Roll the D. What you call it there? Uh, D ten. D twenty. Seven. Eighteen. The saddest thing about poor Corey is he now fails two death saving throws. L. He's still alive for the time being, so it's all good. Did it else your turn? Need not be. Uh, uh, nope. That'll be my turn. Battery. Mm, okay. Um, we have a little peek around this corner and oh. Okay, that's still a lot happening. Um. <laughs> is it? Mm. Mm, do, I, weird. do I have advantage here? Uh, what are you trying to hit? Uh, this guy... How do, how do I do the pointer thing again? Hold it. Double click. Oh. Uh, no, you see him fresh and he sees you fresh, so it's uh, blank and blank. You're just straight rolling each other. Mm. Yeah, if one had used bonus action yeah. hide prior to this... Oh, okay. Well, fuck it. I will just straight up bolt him. No, you don't. <laughs> sure about that. Never mind. Oh. I shall hide back <laughs> around my corner hmm? and use my bonus action to take another potion of healing, even though it tastes like shit. Does it? And hell, mm, nothing tastes Reminds me of a stepdad. Oh my god. Huh? No, never mind. Corey, privately to me, 1d20 please. Yes sir, private to DM. Mm. Yeah. 
we move over to the toil. Toidle! Hurrah, <laughs> Raggy! I've got to run like the wind, right? Yep, full movement before you can do anything else. <coughs> this guy's taking a no long time. guys, something I want to do. Is that an else return? Did you run? Oh, yeah. It's yeah, okay. Just run in as far as you can. You see Siren, oh. and you see the lying body of the man you met a few hours ago. Hey, Toe. Oh, fuck. What happened here, mate? Uh, he was dominated from the. Yes. From what I can tell, because uh, he started attacking me, so. I put him down. I heard don't ask, don't kill, and that's all I need to know. Can we, mm -hmm. uh, can we squeeze his little garage door button? The little device we got from the Habibi guy? Maybe send it back to the other plane? Uh, no. The no, garage you can't. door button was something you else. Can't, you can't leave out much. Okay, okay. Yeah, you're the boss, boss. Nice. Uh, there's well, a bunch of bad day. shit going around inside. I got told to run away. Don't know why the fuck I listened. Seems like something I probably shouldn't have done. But, uh, Fair yeah. Enough. So, I'm gonna... Yeah. I am going to... Did that running away count as my action? No, you were just moving, using all of your movement prior. Sweet shit. I am going to go... Yeah, this is getting a little fucking sketchy for me, and I'm gonna withdraw into my shell. <laughs> Valid. <laughs> <laughs> so can he do that? And I'm out. Yeah. 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 It, 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 read, read the uh, feature he's just put in chat. Shell, you put plus four to your AC and advantage on strength and constitution oh saving throws, but you are prone and your speed is zero. Um, you have disadvantage in dexterity okay. saving throws and you can't take reactions. I was going to say, doesn't he already have like an 18 AC or something like that? 17, so now he's got a 21. <laughs> just watch oh, you just... this boy here oh Gumby you are the dumbest fucker here but you know what we bow is that because he played by you at the minute Ooh. natural 19 which hits for 10 on the amnesia alright you ready to hear some dumb shit you ready to hear some fucking dumb shit guys He's then going to stunning strike. Oh my fucking days. These attacks hit him, by the way. Because we can't see him, because obviously you're rolling them privately. Yep. Uh, one attack hits, and then he has. He's only rolled one attack. Hmm. Sweet. Do you know what? I take it back. I've forgotten. I've forgotten, and it's even dumber for me. Um, random, random question. If I was to push Ricky, he's floating. Was he here? He's floating. So he's floating. ten goes to yeah. He's flying. I forgot about that. So the ten will go to here instead, and I'll take back the stunning strike. Eighteen for five random plus question. six, eleven. Yep. If I was to jump on Ricky, would he shoot in like one direction, like a fucking? <laughs> it's not Mario, cunt. Just <laughs> shell and Mario. <laughs> And then we, he we will boop, 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 out here because the Amnesia is floating and flying, so therefore I can't touch him. Do 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 do. Move over here, yeah, save myself the key points. Uh, Boy will run out here, be. taking a little look, and he'll close the door behind him and start swinging his chains in a very kinky fashion. Oh, hello. How are you doing there, come pal? Thing. Hit this boy me, here me. will walk on up, and as he does, he looks at you, Siren, and he will ask you for a cuddle once more. I don't like that. Bad touch. Fuck off. Do not consent. Do not consent. <laughs> Manono Square. Fuck off. Gonna need a anti-grapple from you, please. Uh, and that is what strength? Or a... Dexterity. Strength versus dexterity based. Well, acrobatics or athletics. Uh, is it? Uh, okay, okay. I'll do acrobatic. Fuck. And then he'll rub his beard all over you because kinky. And that misses. Hell. Imagine missing someone when you're holding onto them. 
That's that's tragic. Siren, you're up. Uh, well, since Blessing of the Raven Queen doesn't take anyone with me, he can uh, politely fuck off. He looks, goes womp womp. And then I'm going to just spam Eldritch Blast it. Yo yo. Noticing, I'm, I'm noticing a theme with me, just spam Eldritch Blast. 24 8 will hit. 28 for 6 will hit. 8 6 is. Around 14. Did I announce your turn? Or you boom, boom, boom. Uh, is this motherfucker dead? Uh, you will find out what's going on when it comes to his turn. I was say, because uh, if he is, there's something I would like to do. Uh, uh, yeah, if he is, there's something I'd like to do. We'll find out when it gets to him. Or if you make the okay. appropriate checks to see what's going on. Uh, what would that be? Just medicine? Medicine as your action. Okay, okay. Yeah, I'm, it's just I've got a, an ability that I can use if I kill someone. Is it enough? Yeah. Uh, mm, uh, uh, I'm gonna just take a couple steps backwards. Oh fuck, that's way more than a couple. There we go. Got it. That is me. Battery. Mm. What is my plan? What is my plan? Ooh, I can see one of Fat Man's chins. <laughs> I'll let you know right now that he would have a plus five to his armor class, but if you can see it, you can hit it. Gobble, gobble, gobble. Plus five? Wait, does he speak gobble, English? Gobble, gobble. Or, uh, <laughs> does he speak English? English? English or Spanish? Fucking... <laughs> <laughs> um, Reduces your movement to zero. <laughs> domain, domain expansion, English or Spanish. <laughs> Does he speak uh, whatever I speak? Yes. Do you speak what I speak? We have a graph. Fucking we need. Okay, okay. If you fuck around in shop class, you'll find out. So don't fuck around in shop class, you fuck around too much. <laughs> you know what? <sighs> You're not making this easy, huh? Fucking porky pig out here. Fucking porky pig. Must be what's here. Never mind, fuck it. I'm just, I'm just going to do the good old usual from a distance, and I shall. Fuck, he's the only one I can really attack. Um, bug it. I shall sneak attack you with move. the. Uh... Oh, can I not move and then steady him? You need, as you read it there, uh, you give yourself advantage to bonus action. Uh, you can use this bonus only if you haven't moved during this turn. Ah, oh, fuck. So you can move back and steady him. But his armor class mm -hmm. increases by five as a result. Hmm. You can hit him if his armor class fuck. is up by that. Um. Yeah. Fuck it. It's it's my only choice. And it's not just on a net twenty. Yep. Yeah, you steady him. Okay. I will steady him and. Peek around the corner, see his fat folds, and I will take aim and sneak attack his uh, third chin. 
It's a lot of set. Oh! Oh! I want to. I want to let you know. Only has two chins. I want to let you know right now. His AC is currently twenty six. Oh my Double god! So here's where shit gets real fun. Okay, here's where shit's about to get real fun. You rolled Roll twenty five. Okay, you rolled twenty five. Then you've got additional eight. You can now roll another five d six. Oh god! Oh, oh baby, uh, so wait, what's up? Uh... Slash R five d six. Oh yeah. Be crazy damage again. Be crazy damage again. Plus 18. That's, that's, still, better than, that's still better than average. 51. Okay. Let me check here. Uh, 5d6. Yeah, that's just higher than average. Uh, actually, no, that is average. Average is 17.5. Because 17 and 18, you have a 10.3. Is you. 5d6? Yep, 17. It's a 10.03. 10.03% 10 chance of hitting 17 and 18, therefore 17 and a half. As you fire off for a total of 51 points of damage. Um. <laughs> It Ooh, that's a lot of damage to a chin. It doesn't look like it does nearly as much as you thought it would. He only takes 25 yeah, but his chins will be damage. His chins will be jiggling for the next couple turns, though. Of course, you lie there. It's the final... <laughs> Roll a d4. Ooh... Nope, that's a d6, dumbass. <laughs> As you feel your soul being torn from your body, being recycled, yeah, you are to be reborn as a Lemur and one day's time. A I don't know what that means. It's a creature, a lemur. Uh, oh man, this this really does look like you. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> <laughs> Where'd you get uh, Cody's nudes fee? <laughs> it's, it's not his uh, only fans. There's Mrs. sending them. Some Christian mingle. I just read whatever. Uh, I, I just need to get that creature up. Spit. A spectre. Then uh, I will duplicate. Spectre accursed. Let's see. Uh, so when you slay a humanoid, you can cause the spectre to rise as a spectre with a statistics in the monster manual. When a spectre appears, it gains temporary hit points equal to half your warlock level. Roll initiative for the spectre, which has its own turns at visual verbal commands, and gains a bonus to its attack rolls equal to your charisma modifier. You just remember that one, and you've already got this bitch in the initiative going now. There we go. Bash, bash, whoosh. So, you. Shuffle from this mortal coil. I'll give you one hit point so that way you can still actively look around and see what's going on so it's not all blank and gloom. Mm. Toidle, you are in your shell, you're hearing all this shit going on. Uh, oh, that is a bearded devil, like right by me, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Alright, well, I only got so many choices. Uh, let's see what the turtle can do, gentlemen. <laughs> Is it action or bonus action to pop out of my shell? Uh, Emerge one bonus action. Yep. 
Okay, cool. That was what he calls um, it. Yeah. Calling it, you damn right it is. You just tickles my butthole a little bit and pop goes the weasel, if you know what I'm saying. Why? Why? Uh, why did you go country when you said that? I don't know. I, I, I want to know why he went for his butthole first. You know, the deep south just kind of sound similar to each other, gentlemen. I don't know what to tell you. Baby, lock them doors and turn them lights down. Hello, Kentucky. Okay. Welcome to your mama. Uh, so, since I popped out of my shell as my bonus action, I'm going to make a good old uh, swipey swipe with my claws. Jason, shut up. 1946 will hit. You watch this. Then, uh, yeah. can, I can use passive, right, to get uh, uh, two extra attacks in. Uh, you've got your normal attack, so you've got two attacks per your action. Oh, okay, that's what the passive ability is? It's yeah. It's pretty much a multi-attack? Yep. Okay, I, I was I was thinking I got like four attacks plus my two bonus, okay. As you swing off both of these attacks, you realize your claws aren't doing nearly as much damage as they should be. Are these guys resistant to magic? No. Your claws aren't magic, though. Oh, you're right. My my unarmed attacks are... Didn't announce your turn there, buddy. Okay. Yep, that's me. Sorry, folks. I tried. I punched him. You go. Boy here mm. with absolute in, monk flavor will run sprinting across the wall, flinging himself around, and will give full cracky chan vibes. That is a 17, and then a 22. 17 and 22 for 3, 6, 9, 9, 12, 12 plus, 12 plus 9 is 21. I say I'm more scared of Cracky Chan than I am Jackie Chan. Uh, there goes my dice six. He will then go ahead and go ahead and make his little, uh, you know, knock that off once more. And he will. I nearly hit myself in the bollocks with a metal D20. Imagine how much pain I'd be in. Um. Now there is a natural 15 for. Eight, he is still standing. Cracky Chan will once more give him the wata. Thirteen naturally hits five, and he is from this mortal plane. Takes an elbow to the shoulder and is gone. Cracky Chan will turn round and go wata. Wa wata Chain devil at this point here will throw a chain towards the turtle. Uh, Eighteen for fourteen shall hit the title. Toitle, I require you. Require you, Toitle, to make a strength. Oh, you're not. Sorry, just hits rather. Never mind. You are restrained and grappled. Restrained, grappled, and you take eight points of damage. And you'll take a further fourteen at the start of your next turn. Uh, he will then go ahead to Cracky Chan and will throw a chain towards Cracky Chan. 24 for 16 will hit, but it will only take 10. We'll then throw over a uh, chin for pubes. He will kind of stand there and runs over to this guy and be like, Oh my god, you're so great. I love you so much. Spectre! Uh, Spectre is going to do Spectre business. But. 10 minutes. Right, there we go. Is it plus five damage or plus five to hit at curiosity? Uh, it's a bonus plus five. Let me have a read. Uh, it's roll it gains a special bonus to its attack rolls equal to your charisma modifier. It doesn't actually say. This says gains a special bonus to its. It says it. Well, no, it says attack rolls. So I'd assume that's the roll to hit. Because otherwise, I'd say it'd be damage. That makes sense. 
Yep, I get it. Kill, kill, there we go. Start it. So, he's gonna come to here. Gonna move around to here. Gonna come to here. Move around to here. Look at this dude in front of him. Like, what's up, bitch? And he's going to drain <laughs> his life. Over here playing hopscotch. He's gonna fucking suck his soul if he can. I added go. plus five Whoa. to that. What the fuck? Um, it's battery's job. <laughs> nah, it's this dude's job now. It's it's fucking. So it's, my, it's Corey's character. Hold on. Now. Seven, <laughs> give me give me a sec. Uh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Misses. Damn. I really whipped out the fingers. Do you see the news? Oh, I'm going to quickly change his name just so that we were all aware. There we go. Did anything else? What? Don't worry. Oh, okay. Uh, he's just going to move to there to give the other guys, if they want to move up, and type free reign to do that. Okay. Yeah, and Nizu will make its way up and away. It has done what it wished to do, and we move over to Siren. Siren's just going to move a little bit further forward. There's a lot of people in the way now. Uh, and she's just gonna look at that dude. And we're gonna do last first, same as the first. Spam will just blast. Yeah. It wants to roll it. Is you have a plus 10 a hit. So you could actually do something real fucking crazy and just roll 3d20. Okie dokie. Sounds crazy, I know, but trust me. There you go, there's 3d20. So 13, 20, 13, and 17. So. But yes, I could be missed on that one or something. Yeah, 20 and 17 both hit. So we'll roll 2d10 plus 10. 2d10 plus 10. Yep. Uh, slash r1d or 2d20. Two, slash r2d10 plus 10. Yes. Yeah. For 17 points of overall damage. You get a flat mod, well, that's fucking great. And uh, it's gonna get pushed back 20 feet. 5, 10, 15, 20. Fuck off. Did anything else? No, I'm gonna just take another couple steps closer. Just a little few steppy steps. That's me. Battery. <laughs> Sir hmm. Chilliam the third is gone. You watch as he floated up okay. the stairs. A <laughs> chili in the third. <laughs> Alright, let me pull the same bullshit on his little friend over here. I'm going to hit him with a wambo combo. Um, specifically, I'm going to pull a butters on him. Corey, because you are... Corey, because you're currently out give you access to the monks, that way you're not sitting there doing fuck all. Let's see, 28, this guy's AC up by 5, you hit, 10, 23. You've got another, you've got another, uh, oh, he's gone. D20 roll. You say you got a D20 roll, take it, crit fish. Why, you got a D20 okay. roll? we'll take the other, because he's steady aim. Ah. Gone from this just, mortal coil. I'm just giving that extra extra bit of damage anyway, just for the hell of it. Yeah, just because if you can, and, why uh, not? You know, extra damage is extra. Battery damage. is just going to lean against the wall and take a little seat. Wall sitting casually in the middle of a battle is crazy. Turtle. I mean, she's very relaxed. Oh shit! You have no uh, movement. Oh, you must use your action to break the restraint. Can I use my action as an attack? Can I attack the chains to break the chains? No. Even if you could, that would be a like, disadvantage, I'm pretty sure. Oh, uh, shit. Uh, all right. Got to click on myself here. Uh... Alright, so how do I break the chains? Do I roll you a strength check? Roll me a strength, uh, yeah, strength check. It's technically a grapple. As you try your hardest, they do not break. 
DC is 14. I'm gonna so use my uh, my one of my lux and I'm gonna reroll that. that okay, reroll the d20. Slash roll one d20. Oh. Oh, damn. Fuck oh, me! Every time he's used Lucky, he's rolled lower than he initially rolled. <laughs> Don't anything else in your corner, buddy. It's gonna fucking work, right? Like. You say, how many, how many times can you do that for one thing? All that luck of the Irish is diluted by the American. <laughs> <laughs> diluted by all the cheeseburgers. Fuck you, mean. Then yeah, no, else you turn there, hon. All the bacon grease. I. I really got any bonusy action things I can. Can I? When he threw his chains at me, did he do that at disadvantage? Because of my dodge. You only dodge for one turn. Oh, yeah. Okay, I thought it was like kind of okay. Well then. I guess I'm a I'm a, I'm gonna go some patient defense. Grab yeah, up. that's it for me. Hmm. I'm cool, Cody. You're now playing this cracky chan. Ouch! Oh, the hard old man and the cracky chan. Okay, first thing I'ma do. Ah, uh, fuck. Well, oh. since I'm the cracky chan, I'ma do this. Wholeness of body, he you are rolling me. privately, but I will up you to say 30 hit points. There you go. Thank you, baby. Nothing else I can do. Don't think I don't know. Oh, wait, I, I can't eat Fury of Blows because there's no one near me. You've got all of your movement, and you also need to make an attack to do Fury of Blows. But you How still far have, can I move again? Um, 55 foot. So that's, that's 50. 25. 30, 35, 40. 40. Yeah, you can do that, there you go. Go ahead, space bar, and you do that. And you stand next to him. He looks at me. You <laughs> cannot. <laughs> give yourself the key point back. As I stated, you cannot flurry your blows. You need to use oh, your action shit. to make an attack. Yeah, I, I, I was half listening. So uh, I I can't attack now. You cannot attack at this moment but in time. Is there anything I can do? Because I don't know his shit. Um. Bonus action, patient defense. If you have it. Yeah, bonus action, oh, patient no. defense. You haven't used. You haven't given yourself the key point back. So by all accounts, you can just technically dodge as the bonus action. Yeah. Okay. I'm a dodge. Then you dodge, and you then move over to the Chine Devil. As he looks at you and starts singing Fleetwood Mac. <laughs> well, fuck, I don't understand your language. Speak of the English, okay. motherfucker. He will okay. make two uh, chain attacks. Okay. Okay. My name is Gumby, I'm from Vietnam. Get what it is, what it does, what it does. The so he's I natural don't 13. <laughs> and a natural 10 both hit. What? Yep, so you're about to take... Uh, I'm confusion. Natural means on the dice before modifier. So a natural ah. 13, your armor class is... 18. 18. He has a plus 8 to hit. 18 plus... Uh, 13 ah, plus 8. Lovely. A natural 10 would also hit, because it then becomes meets it, beats it. So you take mm -hmm. 4d6 plus 8. You take 8... Wow! Wow, that was piss poor. You take 18 wah, wah, wah. points of damage. Wah, wah. And you cannot be restrained, so you know. Spectre! Okay. Like, there's gonna do its thing, move closer, try and suck out its soul, all that good t shit, you know. All Just that good thing. Plus you five plus, on that. Yeah, as well. see, I've added the plus five to life drain. So how are you fucking it up that it's not going through? Because when I roll I it, know. when I roll it here, see how I'm there's a plus five? Yeah, I'm just rolling it off the sheet. So, 9, special 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, uh, 13. 
9, 10, 11, 12, uh, 13, plus 5 makes 18, 18 which eight. hits for 3d6 necrotic. And then it um, makes yeah. a constitution saving throw. And I believe this would be classed as magical. DC 10 is really fucking easy. Yep. It's saved, so mm -hmm. it's, its hit points are not drained. Damn. But it loses health, which is all, which is the important part. Yep, it still lost its health. Then we move over to Siren. Sup, bitch. We'll move a little closer. Move over to Melee Cyrex. Uh, gonna lose, look at look at that bitch. And I'm gonna last one I say was the first again. Span Eldritch Blast. Yep. Yep. Oh, baby, Ooh. triple. 17, it oh, oh, it, 24, boy. 36 points of powerful owies. Nice little yowies. Did anything else for your turn? Uh, and yeah. that, I believe, shall be my turn. I don't think I have anything else I can do. Battery. Also, Siren, do you not gain hit points mm. due to uh, Hexblade's curse? Oh, yeah, from a. Uh... From uh, Mr. Speck now. Uh, I get. Hang on a second, let me read it. <clears throat> the view in the window, there's window nothing there. You would kindly. Uh, if the curse target dies, you regain hit points equal to your warlock level plus your conversion modifier. Oh, so I get uh, 10 plus 5. I like that for me, I like that. Let me add that. I like adding the hit points, it's satisfying. That's 25, not 15. Stubbs, what are you planning uh, here, boy? Oh, they closed the door, huh? There we go. I did 15. <laughs> There's not much I can do from here. Uh, I think uh, Battery will just take a little seat on the ladder and uh, sip another potion of healing for herself, make herself feel better, and just wait for this all to blow over. <laughs> a nice cold healing potion and wait for all this to blow over. Exactly. Turtle. Ricky. Yes, sir. Just take the good old turtle strat. <laughs> Alright, am I am I still fucking encumbered by these motherfucking chains? Yeah, you're still bound up like a gimp in a BDSM club. You know what? I'm tired of these motherfucking chains on this motherfucking turtle. That one. And <laughs> break free. I want, I want to, to break, break free. free. The turtle I broke to free. Full like fucking Vegeta free. and just brr, lightning strikes as you I scream. I am a gladiator. Technically, I am a performer. I'm just putting on a show. Start doing the little jazz hands. Ta -ta -ta -ta. And then I'm gonna use my movement. Is the Spectre on our team before I go over and punch it in its face? Yes. Cool beans. I'm gonna go over here. And then I am going to. I probably shouldn't have got super close to him. You have no attacks, however. So. Yeah. What yeah. Are you thinking? We discussed this the last time. I need to make an attack to make more attacks. Can I use my bonus action to just make an un or an offhand attack? You need to make an attack first to do that. It's really weird, but it's part of like the attack <laughs> of action. It is. Uh, uh, fuck. Okay. You know what? We're gonna activate patient patient defense, and then we're gonna just we're gonna we're gonna end our turn. Gomba, Tori. Well, hello there. Uh, how many hits? Can uh, you can make two normal attacks, and then you need to use a key point to use a flurry of blows. So I'm going to do a uh, bat. 17 for 8 hits. Bat. 21 for that hits, and it's still standing. Bat. And it's no longer standing. If you do 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 Just left, right, upper cut, good night. And it droppeth 
to the ground. Dead. I just grab its head and start teabagging. And I, I don't want to steal its chain. <laughs> okay, you take his chain. You have There's a fuckload chains. of weapons out of those tables there, boys. Alright, right, well, he does why? that. Let me, uh, is there anything of interest in this room, uh, money wise, value wise? There's a coin. Uh, can I, can I search I Corey's that. character's dead body? The coin you found. I say no, I don't give consent. You're dead. Consent doesn't, doesn't matter. matter, you're dead. You're an object. <laughs> you, you, there's nothing to have on me. Okay, you're still an object. I'm still gonna search you. Don't take my magic wand. I'm gonna take whatever the fuck I want to take. Don't take my magic wand, trust um, me, you don't know where it's been. There is just take a wand. The fuck I want to take. Standard equipment and spellcasting focus. No, uh, I search the bodies that are in here. Or hey, no, baby, sorry? You ever went all the way with a turtle? No weapons, like search the bodies. Single dagger. Single dagger, okay. Uh, can I tell what wand it is? Yes. This is spellcasting Mine. focus, nothing special about it. It's spellcasting focus. Okay. Does um, he have coin on him? At all? Nope. Okay, dokie. Well, he's useless. Both <laughs> in life and Even in, in death. death. You find... Uh, in regards to... You find three soul coins. Soul coins? Ooh. What the fuck is uh, in, in, like on the bodies in here? Yeah. Uh, can, I start, can I start the weapon Oh, sweet, rack? okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna take those bad boys. Add them to your sheet uh, now. Uh, and then there was a, a weird coin, right? Like an unknown coin? Uh, no. Sorry, sorry, I was gonna be sure we had everyone. Just have three soul coins and some playing cards. Ooh. Yeah, I'll take the playing cards too. Am I able to search oh, these? Okay, uh, well, Ricky can take the playing cards then. Give them to Ricky. Thank you. Ricky's about to go. Oh, we have them, Turtle Ricky Boy. We shall I'm meet in. Really, I should go play some gambling them. later. Who wants to lose their gold that I'm just going to give away like Robin thing. Hood? So. <laughs> I mean, I, I'm probably the richest out of all of us, but I also have three soul coins, so. Yeah, <laughs> be, my be my sugar mummy. Be my sugar mummy. Woo! Oh, okay, yeah. There you go. Uh, yeah, can I search all these weapon racks? See if there's any interesting weapons. Just pole arms, really. Pole arms. You ever been that... devoured by a toothless oh, turtle? Is that, a, is that a trident? Is that a trident? Technically a pole arm. But is it, does it look like a trident, though? It is is a that a pole arm that looks like a trident? Can I take the trident? You can take the trident, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have a trident. <laughs> Call me Pussy Jackson, one. Oh, thanks. You know what? You no longer have a trident. No! My trident! Happy rated. How long does that spectre last for? Uh, until my next uh, long rest, I believe. Let me double check. Double check for you real quick, just because I love you, Matthew. Uh, once you buy out, oh, Spectre remains in your service until the end of your next long rest, at which point it vanishes into the afterlife. Anybody I don't know if that, that big chin guy was? I don't know if that means it bypasses the whole... Um... What's it called? Uh, it went up. So, whole Matthew, I know, contract. I know for experienced people this may be stupid, but... As a shapeshifter, could I change into looking like one of the people in this room, like the like the chain guy or something, like the chain devil? Um, or one of the bearded a, devils. As a changeling, you can change into basically any anything you've seen before. I believe. Let me let me pull up the book. The amount of people I've had play changeling and none of them have actually used the changeling ability is. It says, Shockingly including high. your coloration, hair length, and sex. You can also adjust your height between medium and small. Ooh. 
You can make yourself appear as a member of another race. Though none of your game statistics change, which is fine. You are a face, small, medium. Uh, shape changer is an action. You can change your appearance to determine this. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, Must have the same basic arrangement of limbs that you have. You can du you can't duplicate the appearance of an individual you've never seen, and you must adopt the form and the same basic arrangement of limbs. Your clothing and equipment aren't changed by the straight. You stay in the new form until you use an action or die. Ah, uh, you could turn into the chain devil or bearded devil. Yeah. Could he potentially turn into Job of the Hut as well? Uh, no. No, he's not. He's complete. He's a bigger size. No, he's, I, he's okay, the same and size. And also have costume. He's the same size. Costume um, clothes allow me to change my clothes, right? He just he just has additional limbs that you do not. The wings, wings, yeah. Okay, I will change. Use my changeling ability. Shape shifting ability, change into the chain devil, and then also use my costume clothes to take his clothing. So look exactly Why like him. Just take his clothing. I can't do that, can I? Chain devil. Um, so you could just take his clo clothing. You notice how the chain devil it. wore chains. <laughs> just, just wear chains. I'll just, I'll just take yeah. his chains and wrap them around me. Then, too late. I've already stole them. Throw a pin. Give me his I fucking chains, you fashion. dick. Nope, mine now. Wait, you're dead. How the fuck did you take nope. them? I'm a monk now. <laughs> Remember, I'm, I'm cracky chan now. <laughs> I needed the what? chains. No. I love it. Okay, wait. Where, where are you? Where? I'm just down. standing in the middle of the room, whipping the chain when like gets a big. Oh wait, so you're not even there. Okay, see, I'll. No, I'm, I'm, here. Like I'm, here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. Oh, that's. I grab, you. I grab them from outside, and I, I, I'm sitting with the chains, spinning them around like the rock did in that one Jimmy Fat big fucking candy worm. Right. Well, here's the thing, you stupid cunt monk. I need those chains. If I can go upstairs and convince that fat cunt up there that I Give am me one of your soul out. coins in. You don't know that I've got those. You were outside when he got them, you wouldn't know he has them. Mm, would I? No, you were outside. I <laughs> you were outside, you don't know I've got those. <laughs> Motherfucker. Uh, Give me something in return then. Uh, how's about I part ways with 100 gold? Mm, no. Mm, okay, I was going to offer him 5 to... gold. Jason, what's up? Uh, would we know where the Blade of Avernus is? Um, nope, because I'm dead. And this, you're not the Blade of Avernus. Uh, the Blade of Avernus, uh, about nine years ago was mm. found by a tiefling cleric, a half elven ranger, and uh. a Asimar paladin when they fought oh, was. when they fought Archduke Zariel to death. The strange thing yeah. is, now that you think about it. The stories did initially mention a warforged called Armament 20 who seemed oh, to vanish oh, at mm. some point throughout the oh. travels. So in other words, there might be a Blade of Avernus here, potentially. The party had overthrown mm. Zariel mm. and in overthrowing Zariel, they are now the current ruling party of Avernus. Okay. In other words, okay, there could okay. be a blade of Avernus here. 
Yes, you've I said like that. The Blade Anyways. of Avernus is the bad ending. These guys got the good ending. It's not the Blade of Avernus, it's the Blade of Zariel. Oh, Blade of Zariel. Uh, out of uh, curiosity, my friend, how much gold would... Uh, what do you suppose, Zariel? Allow me to at least borrow those chains while we head up this ladder. Bear in mind mm. I would be assisting you, of course, in this situation. Thank you. This benefits both of us, my friend. I'm just pointing that out to you. How about I give you half the chain? Motherfucker, how are you gonna split it? And what what will we tell the fat count upstairs, exactly? That I lost I... half my fucking clothing? Yeah, I got, I got punched too hard and half my, my chains. Okay, here's the thing. I'm going to give them back to you. I'm just asking to borrow them while we're upstairs. Well, I don't care. Just have them. Thank you. All I want in return is just a single one of the little spiky ones. I have an idea. Okay, yes. Yeah, so, so the weapons he has on the end of his... Yeah, Corey, you cut out again there, so... So, see the weapons he has on his chains? The hooks? Yes, that's what I want in return, just a singular hook. The hooks that okay, are attached yes. to the chains? Yes, I'm going to break see, one off. See previous statement about how you're going to do that? Uh-huh. No, that's a question, Corey. How are you going to break the chains? Uh, me a monk. That means nothing against chains. E. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to smack it until it breaks. Larry, chap it. Put some tension on it. After all, I'm cracky chan. Magical items don't just break, Corey. Motherfucker, I was gonna try and attach it to my javelin. And... He's he's gonna bend it wait, over wait, his wait. knee and try to break it like a stick. Question: Where the <laughs> fuck did his character come from? I was not paying attention. Crackville. Algebra. Uh, he was last in last session. Math. He was there when you were all brought in. Oh, okay. But yeah, you have all uh, you have all wheels. You have your chains, you crack upon your chains mm. to look like um to look like him. You now look like a chain devil. Okay. And uh now I look correct, I shall head up this ladder. Uh give me if I'm not out and uh You guys follow very quickly behind. That's probably for the best. Okay. You find the ladder, stay still. And then we'll move you up the ladder. You see it's there, creature. Yeah, we're told to follow quickly, apparently. So, I'll follow you quickly. <sighs> Me too. He's reclaiming these stairs immediately behind him. Mm -hmm. And while they climb, I'm going to... Okay. Oh. Wait, let me just approach him. Okay. And, uh, does he react in any way to my appearance? He looks at you. He has the slight look around and goes back to fixing the chair. He's fixing the chair? Fixing it up. Making it look excruciating. Y'all boys. Uh, okay, and we 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 still don't know what he speaks, right? We don't know if he speaks. You don't know what he speaks. We do know what he speaks. Party climbs the chair, the stairs, and he climbs the ladder, and he takes a look and takes a look at you, and then as he says some words and points towards them. Yeah, I'm afraid I won't be doing that, buddy. His eyes narrow. You wanna have a little conversation we're, with us, or we're assuming this might we're gonna blood this the hard way? Yeah, that's the drop. Yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna 
move my spectre off the edge. So I'll just move like that. He looks at you. Mm. You're the greater. He. He speaks another language, language other than infernal. And looks at you. See, I knew you could understand me. Give me one reason not to dump you in the stick. Because mm. <coughs> I'll ask you nicely not to. He watches the words of an incantation start to touch his fingers as they start to light up as he stares at you and his eyes narrow as he gives a toothy, disgusting grin. You know what this sounds like what to me? Here, what were we here for again? Uh, armament. A sword or in my mouth. Corey's gone. Oh. Fuck. So, um... Here's the deal, okay? Me and my friends here are looking for an item. Two. two that items. you may be able to help us with. Oh, two items, two sorry. It was a sword or something. Not a sword, a uh, uh, shield or something, and orb of dragon kind. You see that in his eyes later. Yeah. The orb. Mm hmm. You seem to know about that. Oh, I know a lot about the orb. Oh, you do, do you? Mm -hmm. Very much so. You won't just part with the orb. Or the shield. Kind of figured that. Kind of figured that. Uh, does he also happen to have a sword? No. He? Which of them carries the sword? It's a it's a shield, I was I was mistaken. No one carries a sword. He has hmm. a rapier. No one carries a sword. Mm -hmm. But he is a warlock. Pardon, what was that? He is a warlock. So am I. Dedicated War to the Raven Queen. So am I. Well then. The, the Raven Queen is a... He's better. <laughs> I'm, I'm not gonna doubt that. I mean... To be a member of the party that plays Dariel... That, Kinda of have to be better than I would be. He's on the roof. He's on the roof. Okay. Mm. Uh, um, and you're loyal to him, are you? Uh, 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 oh. Do you know when the uh, do you know when the sword was last seen? What sword? The sword of Zariel. The sword of Zariel is held by those who now rule Avernus. Held oh, by who? Oh, that shit. rules Avernus, sorry? Those who rule. Yeah, which one of them? There's three. The Tiefling. The Tiefling, okay. You're pretty, ch you're pretty chill for a demon, in all honesty. Demon. Yeah, that's or devil, devil spawn. It looks um, more like Slimer's poop. Uh, do, I was gonna say, do I know? Do I know what he is <laughs> exactly? You very clearly know the difference between a demon and a devil. No, no, like, do I know what he is? Like, what? Yes, he is. You got, like, he, devil, he, is, devil. he is an amnesia. Ah, uh, uh, then he's, he's chill on amnesia. Double. I was gonna say I didn't know what he was, so just sort of like, yeah. Yeah, this dude's pretty chill for an amnesia. Like, just answering questions, like, okay. 
<laughs> I wasn't expecting that. My loyalty is... Mm. Every whoop his ass, I'm assuming he don't want to catch no more ass whooping. I'd be up front and honest, too. My loyalty no. is to Fiana. Who's Fiana? Not? Like the sausage? Fiona. Who is <laughs> Which one? Who's Fiona? Drag's wife? Fiona. <laughs> Fiona. Oh, fuck. Who's Fiona? That the was a fucking good one. I couldn't hear that, sorry, Matthew. The Lady of Flexios. <laughs> okay. Did you know one now? I'd be loyal too. Would, would I know who that is? She is the ruler of the fourth layer of hell. Uh, wait, no. which layer is that again? <laughs> Flexios. Uh, so what not this level. The guy that was talking to us through the ice place. Which, which levels of Erna? The first. Hmm. You're a long way from home then. Wars of spies. Hmm? Fair enough. Oh. So you're spying on the guy upstairs, huh? I was spying on Zariel. <clears throat> Now I spy mm. on Lou. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, um, uh. here's the question. A couple questions, actually. Um, do you know a guy who, like, lives behind an ice wall? Never stop I don't know. <laughs> uh, do you know one who calls himself rigor mortis? People that obviously aren't from Avernus? Or... What layer, what layer is that again? I can't remember what it is, the ice one. It's, Nine. I want to say it's Cadia or something like that. Eight. Level eight, Cadia. Yeah, but, uh, the, do you know one that calls himself Rigor Mortis? <laughs> no devil will ever give you his crew name willingly. No, uh, I know they won't give himself that real name. I was just interested if you knew one that goes by the alias Rigor Mortis. They don't have aliases. We pick a okay, name. Okay, And then you ask. Well then. And we give it. And then you ask again. We and we give a different name. Fair enough. Just pull names out of a little mm. ball. Pretty much. <laughs> no. Is there anything else? Uh. Yeah. <clears throat> um. So I'm assuming you're gonna want to like. Not want someone to know you're a spy, right? B. Little step four. Yeah, I didn't. So there's a little fluttering waves. Um, I, I wouldn't like antagonize him. Battery. I mean, I'm I'm also kind of curious how the hell those wings actually like lift him. <laughs> well, it's, it's, it's a bit like a uh, bumblebee. Wouldn't be able to, but they can. Raises his. And starts to spin it round. You could forget this entire conversation. I forget mm, a lot. I forget a lot of a things. Lot. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, you forget a thousand things every day, pal. Make sure this is one of them. Oh my god, <laughs> that's my trigger. <laughs> it's more of just being punched in the face too many times, and I kind of have like brain damage. But you know, <laughs> similar thing, I guess. Uh, no, uh, I, I'd rather not. I so, got uh, information from this. So, uh, I'm curious. You're not going to, um, hmm. you, you won't, you won't mind if we go upstairs and uh, see the big man up there, right? Do as you wish. <clears throat> Wouldn't 
you like the, uh, cool. the glory of defeating one of the uh, few people that managed to defeat Zarya. He did not defeat her. Uh, who did then? The so, uh, the Asamar and the Deepling. Hmm, I thought Armament was part of the party then. Initially, one point. he banished the orb of Dragonkind. It has a will of its own. Those who are weak are bent to its will and whim. So, in other words, he didn't. He split off before they fought Zario. Perceptive you are. Hmm. Hmm. You really fumbled that bag, huh? Yeah, I mean, he could have he been a member of the party that killed Zario, and instead, you know, let himself get persuaded by the simple orb. What a pussy. I <laughs> <laughs> um, wouldn't put it that way, but sure. That's what you want to describe it as. In the land of the uh, country down under, they just tell you to take a salt tablet and walk it off. You'll be all right, mate. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh. Interesting. <clears throat> all right, who wants to go upstairs and kick the shit out of that guy that's got the stuff we need? I mean, I guess I'll go first. Uh, good luck uh, fixing your chair. By any chance, luck, you everybody ill. You wouldn't know where the teeth is. It's kind of kinky. He moves over to the window and points to the large, blade-like object that flies throughout the city. The fortress. Oh yeah. shit! Okay. So that, that's the teeth fling, not armament. Don't worry, it's not armament. It's the teeth fling. I'm just. Asking about uh, things because you know, Sword of Zario is a very, very interesting thing that I have a feeling at some point will probably get sent after. So, just while we're here, and he's giving information, get as much information as we can about things. You know what I mean? In case we're ever sent back. As y'all, climb the stairs. His stairs is a fucking ladder. You claim the ladder. Right. Uh, oh. Up <laughs> the stairs. Okay. Up the ladder. Christ Almighty. Up the steps. You see. Oh no! It's a green goblin. It's a green <laughs> goblin. I mean. Oh, this. There's oh, like, no, it's Doctor Doom. Yeah, Never mind. Let's say, let's, let's say that's like Mysterio. If Mysterio just took his uh, the mask off and like was holding it. Looks at you. Yes. Hi. Hello. Hi there. Why are you here? Hello. Is it me you're looking for? No. No. Uh, I can see it in your ass. Uh, whoa. I'm, I'm so sorry. Thank you, sorry mate. About We're going to need to relieve you of your items because uh, we think... are being hunted by an Ifri was... and we need to not have that happen. What, what, what was the dude's name that we're doing this for again? Because it's uh, another dude this time. I forget, but don't worry, it's fine. Uh, yeah, we're, we're kind of uh, being pressured by someone to steal items from you. Uh, we don't particularly want to. And don't. Mm. It's, yeah, it's not see, well, that we don't not it's, necessarily want to. If we it's don't, the, we don't want to have uh, to steal you I, to take your yeah, items. Would you yeah. take a bribe? Stop! Stop talking, please. Please. <laughs> but that sounded way too threatening. <laughs> I just, just take a chill pill. It's, it's okay, Donatello. You can have your moment <laughs> in a second. <laughs> oh. If he decides <laughs> to get angry, you can get angry, okay? That was my convoy! Uh, <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, but it, but it's Hiding like, your shell, you're, okay? You're being calm, but what you're saying is very not calm. <laughs> that does sound like me. Ugh. Guilty. But yes, uh, yeah, you see, the thing is, if we don't come back with these items, uh, we're kind of going to die. That's my problem, huh? What? I'm not saying it's your problem. Uh, it's going to become your problem if you don't hand them over. Uh, what are the odds I create the teleporter up his asshole and we teleport him back in by force? Just get to sleep. Uh, what if, what if, uh, mm. potentially you could, uh, help us and then we won't have to take your items? You could just leave. Okay. Yeah, but um, I, I, here's I the thing. Of, like, okay. Mm -mm. This is, this yeah, is amazing. Yeah, let me thing. talk, no, okay? Like living? Yeah, How did you so get did you our friend it? here is like stuck in a loop, okay? They're really confusing themselves. Here's the problem, okay? You say we can just leave? Yep. No, we fucking can't, okay? Because if we just leave, we're going to fucking die. That's true. Okay? So really, we have two choices, okay? You can hand that shit over, or we can kick your ass and take them off your corpse, okay? We, that's really only the two choices that we have. Who says you'll die? Or as I, or as I said, third option. Uh, Who said you'll die? If who says we'll die? Some, some devil uh, person thing? The, no, I don't fucking know. Yeah, uh, I can't remember what his name is, but whatever his name that he gave us, because uh, I'm assuming he's either a demon or a devil spawn, uh, and hasn't actually given us his actual name. Uh, but yes, yeah, so yeah, whoever it was, uh, he's pretty much beat our entire party to the point of he near death. He takes this green orb. With dragons etched on it, and it's about the size of a football, an actual football, uh, Ricky, not one of those fake American ones. Ooh. Watch as it shrinks yep. down to the size of a golf ball before it ropes up his sleeve as he it peers over the American edge. One. Peers over the edge, and how did you get here? What spell did you use to get here? We we didn't use a spell. We were sent here. Yes, what spell was used? Uh, I don't know. I think it was teleport. Well, your little teleporter. Hey, and probably out. best now that we don't know that. Yeah, probably... I think it was. I think it, it was probably from the fact that there was a spell circle on the floor. It uh, was probably we did, oh, actually, plane shift. We had, to, we had to drop a tuning fork. So yeah, plane, plane shift. shift. You know the yeah. specifications of the plane shift spell. Do you know how that actually works? You know what that actually does? Yes. No. Uh, I know parts yes of it, or no. but I can't... Yes I, or no. I can't yes or no. I was going to say I can't perform the spell myself, yes. so no. I asked you are not no. very good at one How answers. It works. It is two words. <laughs> you are here? The answer would be no, clearly. You are here in Avenus. You are here in Avenus. The spell plane shifts particularly states that when you cast it, provided you know where you want to go, you will end up exactly there. All you need is a plane shift spell to get out of here. Yeah, but we don't exactly want to go back to... Then don't specify to is... go back to him. Yeah, but he's already said he's going to hunt us down if we don't come back with it in... What time and was it? How does he know that you've not died? Think. Uh, well... He could quite easily. You no, know, he's actually making a good point. Oh. If we want... use the teleporter, he would probably be able to track it then after it was you. Use the teleporter. Find someone Do you who have can a cast plane can ship. Out of here? I'm a warlock. We cannot can cast, you cast plane, plane shift? shift. Exactly. Very hard to find someone that will cast plane shift out. Do we have in a warlock in the party? Can I go and just that? throttle him a little? E. Right here. Warlocks on all. Cast plane shift. He looks on over and points towards the giant moving fortress. They might. Yeah, I don't, yeah, they might, but funnily enough, I don't think they'd probably be very welcoming considering they also rule Avernus. Yes. They rule Avernus in place of Zariel because Zariel was a warlord. She saw herself as better than everything and holding things. That's not the case, however. They hold the place in balance. Or try. But, uh... Democracy. So the problem with that is... 
it's very hard to find someone in Avernus that will do something for you willingly without trading for your soul. And they're not devil. My soul's already they three are, soul coin. They <laughs> are Nephilim and half elven. They they don't mm. care about yep. your soul. In fact, the less say... they fought to remove Elturel from here. They fought to save an entire city. Oh. Mm. Okay, do you know like the fastest way onto the tower? Because it's kind of moving, so what's that? It seems a little difficult. You got like a, a an Uber or something? <laughs> you'll have to find <laughs> you'll have to find Maggie. Oh, we have to find Who's another Maggie? person. Oh. Mad Maggie, she is a night hag. Like from Apex? Oh. She, oh, she sounds like my aunt. What a wonderful lady. She resides in Fort Knucklebone, and she is the premier dealer of all infernal war Ooh, machines. I like dealers. By any chance, would she try to kill us? The Red Caps might. That doesn't mm. sound like something I want to go through. Uh, what the hell is still so crazy? Just for reference. Just for reference. What I mean, okay. Is. Either way, uh, do do you mind if I hand you my um my map? Could you could you mark it on my map real quick? That would actually be really helpful. That's a good idea. He places his hand out on the back, and if he does. He places a little miracle. to Dubs, I'll put it here in the updates right now. Perfect. What was, what was the, the shield actually called again? Shield of the Hidden Lord. Oh. He marks it on your map and passes it back to you immediately. The orb's the orb of oh. dragon kind or kind, right? That's, yes. Fine. Actually, not too far. That's actually very useful. Hmm. Thank you. Thank you very much. Who knows? Maybe she can cast plane chicken oh. and she's out of here. If not, then there is always... Uh, what was her name? What did they say her name was? Red something. She's in the brambles. She could get you out. Or if you're feeling extremely desperate, there is also Arkan the Cruel. But be warned. Mm. He... Mm, that name's got warning signs. Is it by any chance he cruel? He came from another plane of existence where they fought they fought some some weird god a whispered one or something they said and he cut off his hand and then cut off his own hand and replaced them and then came here to be with Tiamat. Oh Vecna. Hmm. Oh I, 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 I know who you're talking about. And the Vecna. Hmm. Uh, who did you say? How's that? Why Arkan. do I know that name? What was that, sorry? Arkan the Cruel. Arkan the Cruel. Uh, would you be able to just... Can I take the map off? Uh, after if they'll let me. I'd just be like, would you just be able to mark that on our map as well, please? Where we could find these other people, just in case, so we just have our options open. Arkan has his own tower. And the other woman lives in the brambles. He marks both of them. Mm. Okay. Thank you. Mm. I appreciate that. Thank you. You've been incredibly helpful, actually. Um, so sweet, Mother. Yeah, you're a very nice, very nice person. I, I really appreciate that, actually. 
anything to get you out of here as quickly as possible. Okay, okay. Uh, we shall. Job and we just beat up security and then leave. Yes. Yeah, so yeah we, we will uh, make her leave. I'm um, sorry about the guys you... downstairs. What's the uh, whole <laughs> business about uh, trying to get people out of Avernus as quickly as possible? Another uh, uh, devil spawn had mentioned it. Mordenkainen recently left Avernus in a big rush. Wouldn't say why but also gave no warning. He just left. He's been mm. here for 10, 12 years and all of a sudden he feels the need to leave. Then... Are you planning on leaving at all? Then the demons stop flooding Avernus. Almost halting the blood war. Something's off, and something's amiss. Would you like to come with us at some point, if we leave? No. Not right now. Mm. Well, I the offer have... is there. You've been incredibly kind. He takes the shield from his back and stares at it. Other business oh. to attend to you your voice in your head my mother business uh, mm. only I'm just gonna stare at the right. shield Here's this. I'm just gonna stare at it lustingly just mm. oh. I know you Say, um, I know what that uh, is. I'm just gonna, like, in reference to the fact that he's just staring at that shield, and given the fact that we were told about the, like, the shield, like, mm. holding a deep pit fiend or whatever it is, uh, and it's obviously the whole belief that you got to get the fiend out of it to free it or whatever, or whatever. It's just like some. Mm. You're really kind. I'm going to say this like the uh, nicest way possible. I would not recommend letting that thing out. That shield. What oh, do you did. plan with it exactly, my friend? Oh, free him. And let him. Do what he wishes. Mm. <laughs> mm. Uh, we are great minds alike, my friend. Great minds indeed. Battery. Battery. Mm -hmm. Yes. Please. Yes. Shut the fuck out. Please. Just a little bit. No, no. Just, he is our friend. Just a teeny tiny bit. Yes. Just, just chill. So I, I agree the. Uh, I am I very. That very relaxed. I love how you tell me to relax now, but when I'm threatening to kill him, you say nothing, but now I agree with him and we're on the same field. Suddenly you do not wish. Lustful, trustful, and a little all over the place. The, the, the pit fiend mm. in there is not something mm. you want to mess with. Mm. I'm not going to mess with it. There's a, there is a, there is I a want... Reason. There is a reason why fiends can become patrons of warlocks. Think about that. I don't comprehend. I just know I want its freedom. I don't Another believe one. anybody should be trapped. Mm. Vecna probably should, you know. Mm, no. Mm. Everybody yeah. deserves freedom. Yeah. Mm. He spins round and on his fingers, Jason, you see that there are four separate black and purple dots, one upon each finger. 
You can try and take the shield, to... but I don't think it would be I'm in not... your best interest. I'm not, going to... I'm, I'm not going to try and take the shield. I'm not going to. You've already made it clear that you're not going to part with them. Or the orb, or the shield. And, personally, mm -hmm. I don't exactly want to die today. So, um, uh, when exactly do you plan to let him free? We have tried numerous times. But nothing mm. has worked. Do you know of how? Have you tried an orgy? We initially thought you just had to dip it in the sticks, but that didn't work. It turns out that upon a divination, you had to go ahead and use a spy dispel good and evil. Yes, yes, dispel good and evil. But of the 95 times we have tried, not once has it ever <coughs> came to fruition. Did no one try five more times? Maybe it's a one in a hundred kind of thing. <laughs> <laughs> they refuse. Uh, do you um have have you spoken to him? Has he told you anything himself from within? So would I know anything mm. about the field, oh, like yeah. how it how you would release the? walks forth considerably and as he does places just a single hand on your shoulder told me that you are not what you seem mm. is that so he leans in why is the fae in the infernal plane he then takes a small strut towards you. And why does that which resides in the shadow fell opposite the Feywild team with the Feywild? He starts like moving his hands. You're not waving just like. Not waving like you're kind of super high, you're kind of like doing shit, you don't quite know what you're doing. He's doing that. Ricky all the time. Like he's, he's, well, moving, he's, he's moving his hands. He's moving his hands, and there's some cognition in there, but he's just not verbalizing it. Well, uh, you see, I kind of, as a warlock, I'm sure you can relate to this. I do not own my soul anymore. My soul belongs to. Uh, do I know who? But well, I, I obviously know who it is. I can't just can't remember his name. Uh, the Habibi dude, that you, as you refer to him. Muddy. Matthew. Yeah. No, oh, is it just Muddy? Muddy. Yeah. So, What's uh, all Habibi? Uh, do, do we know uh, also what race he is? Would we have a vague idea? Because obviously he can do you can, like, some freaky shit with his hand. Give me an arcana check. I can do that for you, good sir. Sure. We've got plus five in it, hopefully. Relax, man. Oh, I've got a plus five. It's not going to do shit, though, because I can't roll Arcana to save my life. I never roll good on Arcana. <laughs> you. It's Arcana, specifically. I just can't roll good on it. I don't know why. You see about it and... Magical. Hmm. I know magical things. Not fucking this, you know? As he looks at you, as you yeah. see this, and he kind of winds his neck a bit. That was muddy. <laughs> I haven't seen him in uh, quite some time. He's, mm. I'd assume... I'd assume he's good, he doesn't really tell us how he is. He just kind of tells us what he wants us to get for him. Nah. Where is he? Which... Uh, I can't remember exactly where it is. It's some kind of, like, trading village, I think? Uh... In Avenus? Not in Avenus, no. It's oh. in, uh... What's it, what's it called? Baywild? The what's Shadowfell? The Material Plane? What was it was it's in it's in the material plane somewhere. I just can't remember where the place is called. Seriously, Matthew, what is it called? <laughs> like the uh, like vague area. I seen the material plane. Uh, from what I can tell, he does a business of finding rare items. Uh, which at some point, like for example, 
the Orb of Dragon kind, or the sh Shield of Hidden Lords, he might turn around and ask us to retrieve them. I don't know. He doesn't. He doesn't really explain much about stuff. He just tells us when to find something. Yeah, you know I mean, he's restocking. Yeah. I, I, he's I, a shopkeeper. Yeah. And yeah, he just he restocking. Has uh, he done this before? We, I was going to say we we found him. We first met him in Avernus, didn't we? Yes. Yeah. So uh, we we actually met him here in Avernus, I said, oh, and we needed help. I said, you know what I mean? We needed help. And he gave us help. In return, we sold our soul to him. And now do his bidding. And he kind of leans in. You are... not very... not very perceptive of his contract, clearly, but... many no, have made that mistake. Not really. But yes, he... There's no real magic items here anymore that hasn't already been taken by the other devils or demons, so the material plane makes sense, Ooh. yes. However, he would never come for the... This is fine, this is okay, it's torn out. Yes, um... Uh, hmm? You are, are you going are you to okay? want to find Lou. Lou? Lou. Who's, who's this? One of the three on that thing and points towards the huge tower off in the distance. Oh, the, the, like the fort fortress in the sky thing. Find him. He's a cleric. He can get you out. Uh, okay. I'm, I'm sorry, you, um, you mentioned uh, something about him not betraying you under your breath there? No, I didn't. Mm. Battery, sweetie, don't mention it. He's under his breath for a reason. Don't mention it. Okay, okay. Um, mm -hmm. What was I going to say? Uh, oh, uh, would I know anything about how to release that pit beam? Hmm. I'm, 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 I'm going to have to ask you for Arcana again, Chief. <laughs> roll a, roll a semi-decent. The spell good and evil sounds about right. <laughs> I just got to cast about five more times. I'm telling you, yeah. I, I don't have the spell good and evil. I, I would, but just... Cast it on the right. fucking thing. Cast, cast it just to be like, you've helped us, I'll help you, or try to help. I'll cast it once. If it works, there you go. If not... And I go over more punch it, and like... I don't, I don't think... <laughs> they, I just well. smell good people. Do, do we have any, like... Could, does Cory... Can Cory do it? Uh, could no. Yeah, is there any like, any, like, specifics to the thing that I would know or anything like that, like... Just that it's a spell. The power okay. of Christ compels you! <laughs> if if I think, us. can I communicate with the shield? Like, I can communicate with me. Can it, like, hear me at all? Are you asking me, or are you asking... Yeah, I'm, I'm, ask, I'm asking you. The DM? Yeah. Oh fuck! Okay. Have I answered <laughs> all your questions it. in a prompt and timely manner? <laughs> no one star review. Go fuck yourself. Anyways. <laughs> okay, I shall think to myself. In my head, nobody else can hear this. Is there any way I can assist in your freedom? Whilst I stare at the shield. You get no response. I'm sorry, Battery, who are you talking to? Thinking it, not seeing it out loud. Oh, I'm sorry, oh. can you read my fucking thoughts? <laughs> oh, no, I, I thought you were... Uh, I thought you were Siren, talking. Hexblade Warlock with Crystal Boys. No, I, I, I thought you I were shall... talking, that's my bad. 
I shall go up to him and whisper to both him and the shield. Do you know of any way I could assist in the freedom? You gotta spit on the tip and rub it real hard. <laughs> you got a hot dog to to and spit on that thing. Just spit in the shield and rub it gently, see if that works. You gotta give it that spit hot shine. Spit on that thing. Oh, she's fat as fuck. It's. What? <laughs> Is he... Sorry, what? Looks at you in the shield. With its gaze. I have. I, what am I doing? I can actually go ahead and go like this and go to DD Beyond. I can get you these images. I keep forgetting I can do that. Give me a sec. Beautiful. Uh, I like images. Oh, bro, bro, I okay. <laughs> and he just pull out his pride flag. What? Oh. Here is oh, the uh, orb of Dragonkind. Ooh, that thing looks sick. Oh my fancy. god. Is it, I'm just saying, is it green as well or is it like red or something? Green. It's green, okay. And just here saying, I know you can is get red the shield in his hand. Oh, that's kind of cool. That's a very cool design. Oh, it's got teeth. Oh, oh, wait, I can see a face in it. Okay, that's kind of. Yeah, I'm, I'm assuming that's the face okay. of the pet thing. Huh. Yeah. Means then. I almost like the field of Aries. We from believe, uh, Smite. We believe that dispelling good and evil works now. But it yet to be successful. Mm, here's a theory. Uh, I'm sorry, in English? Try... <laughs> to me or What's Jason? English? Um, uh, well, he never speaks English anyway, to you. What would what, what the Pit Fiend say? We're yet to be successful. And again, oh, telepathically, oh, sorry, telepathically to one, one being battery. Yeah. Yeah. Well, okay, telepathically, never mind then. Shield can only speak in telepathy. Mm. Uh, I would hope I'm gonna so. Say to, I'm going to say to Armament, uh, have you tried asking the Pit Fiend? Wait, pit fiends, are they, like, a devil of some kind? Or on that sort of thing, like, do they make contracts and all that, blah, blah, blah? Mm. I feel so. I do so, yeah. They uh, are quite up there. So, so they would have a real name that they keep hidden? Yep. Uh, have you tried asking... Uh, the pit fiend in the shield for its real name and then trying to cast uh, whatever it is summon specific demons and stuff like that or devils and right. just a theory I'm just merely interested in seeing what would happen like would it summon the, the shield would it <laughs> bring the fiend out of the shield and it's done nothing Are we to Gaga about breaking since the shield now? What was that, sorry? And it's done nothing to Gargoth since neither brought the shield nor the fiend. Okay. Believe me when I say mm. that for the five minutes you've been here, I've been here for 11 years. Mm. Sorry, no. I wasn't doubting that. No, it's nine years. I have tried everything. You have have no you tried a welding torch, man? Just, you know, like, open her up? Magic items Maybe just it'll... break. Mm -hmm. Maybe it has to the be... The shield itself cannot take damage, can someone... it? Mm. No. Maybe it has to be cast someone by the person. Maybe in there? It. I, I don't use that. I don't imagine a witch more fist. I don't know. He walks away. He's now how, how, how can I see what weapons I'm proficient with? You're proficient with martial weapons, I think? Let me check. Uh, Where do I see that? You are proficient or, with simple I'm weapons. 
and crossbows, long swords, rapiers, and short swords. Oh, I see. Um. Okay. Um, this may seem a little crazy, but uh, could you put the shield and or hold out the shield and trust me for one moment? Let me take a stab at it. <laughs> he holds the shield. Oh, no, 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 no. Now, uh, I need you to trust me for this, okay? This may no, it is worth a try, you know. Um, what's how, how, what's the distance? Is, is ten foot like two blocks? Okay, there we go. A block between us. I shall take out my whip and just whoosh, and hit the shield. God damn! Him. Not twenty on that as well. <laughs> of course I do. Hey, battery's good with the whip. Right, that whip. Make a what's, wisdom saving What's the saving reaction throw. from the shield? Make a wisdom saving throw. Um, wisdom saving throw. You instantly get free. <laughs> Fuck. You Makes sense. Take upon the frightened condition, you are frightened of the creature and you can't really move closer towards him. The shield gives you that once more in your mind. That makes sense. You think you're the first. On <laughs> shield, everything hits me. <laughs> Only you know, so have you tried being hit from the backside? It was worth a try. You know, I didn't think anyone would ever try and hit it with a whip. Okay, <laughs> nobody is that stupid. You would imagine. Him around, give him a spanking. Knock only I am that dumb. Watches. <laughs> Our moment stands there. <laughs> looking over at the giant pillar. Maybe... Yeah, we should probably make a move. You should head. Before things start to get weird. They hadn't already? Not yet, anyway. I do kind of like weird. I guess I'll come back when things are a little weirder. Hmm. What you gonna stand up, more. dust himself off, and as he does, just walks off the edge. Okay. <laughs> just I. Right. You hear right. you're Fair enough. Massive, okay. You're a massive like thud as he hits the ground. To be you landing. Go to be your landing. <laughs> and after about. A minute or two you just see as he's walking on. Just I'm gonna show he's okay. It took him a minute or two to recover. <laughs> he's... I like to imagine he like rolled a nat one on that fall and just <laughs> fucking face planted. <laughs> no, no, he did a he did a superhero landing, but it locked his uh gaze in his knee. But as he watches he <laughs> he's he's got a slight limp as he walks <laughs> off, trying to act fuck. as if he didn't hurt fuck. himself. Fuck. <laughs> But as you just walk on off down the stairs and see him, these who gives you a little look. He's up and no stairs. <laughs> Every time. <laughs> Let's go down the ladder. You head on out back into the plains of Avernus with an idea Ow. of where to go, and we'll see what happens next time. Sure. Oh, we'll just come on. <laughs>